Oh, right. I should bust. Busting makes me feel good. <laughs> Go
<laughs> Oops. All right, let's do this. Hello. Hello. Hail Hello. and salutations, oh brave, brave adventurers. It is I, the Dungeon Master. I'm not brave. Hey there. I don't know, I think you're... Uh... You might not be brave, I, but you're I, definitely strong enough. I think you're not connected to Matt Tools, Cry. Uh oh Which means oh. you are wrong. Oh, God, I really am not brave. I'm that not brave. Holy shizzle. I'm coming. I'm coming. Don't worry, God. I'm on my way. Uh, Toro watches the chat box until he sees your name connect. Excellent. Now we only also, need... you didn't change your Discord picture. Yeah, I did. It hasn't what? updated yet. What? Did you hit save? No. <laughs> Man... I swear, something is up. Me. All right. Uh, <laughs> I fixed it. Hmm. Something is up me. Feels bad. Oh. Or good? I don't know. Uh, questionable. Oh. <laughs> Can we talk about how attractive Tupac is? Uh. Okay. God damn, he's attractive. That's all I had to say about it. He was such right, a mama's go. boy. I know he was. He a mama. Mm. Nice. Okay, okay. <sighs> Just uh... getting those D and D juices flowing, man. Oh man, let me tell you. My I'm next a... character is gonna be Tupac. Anybody want to be my biggie? <laughs> oh, We're gonna have a rivalry. Oh my god, dude! <laughs> I'll be a weed wizard. It'll be awesome. <laughs> Actually, this all sounds so. I do have drugs in the world, so that's not completely out <laughs> oh of the question. Oh my god! This what if we just okay. had a D and D party of all like rappers? I've. I'm down. Okay. Can we do like a San Andreas role play? But San Andreas in the fantasy role. Well, I mean, I want to be Big Smoke. That is actually what you guys are kind of doing. You are in like a crime infested, you know. Yeah, but we're not like. The rapper Crime Gods. Okay. So when I shoot my light crossbow, can I turn it 90 degrees? You can do whatever you <laughs> want. You guys are interesting. It's role play after all. You guys are True. interesting OCs, and I, I like all of you. When, Would when you, you turn it 90 degrees, you know that you're shooting to kill. Yep. Are or, we allowed to break dance in this, or is that like an acrobatics check? That's a performance check, and it is something you can choose to do. Okay, good. If you oh wish. That would add to the performance. Well, whenever you're done uh, snuggling with your dad. <laughs> All right, wait, can we mm. get our tokens now? Yeah, oh, well, I mean, Sheena's not here, so we haven't yeah. technically started yet. Right. Sheena um, and Jund, actually, are both. Uh, I'm here. Oh, I was looking for your, um, oh, your, your, your green icon. But no, you changed it, so no, of course I'm a responsible you boy. You were hiding in plain sight, just like the Watchman guy. Wow. I'm, I'm uh, breakdancing in my sleep, and I, I rolled a seven. Oh. Uh, uh, Neve has a night terror. <laughs> <laughs> and is now sleeping in the bed the opposite way. <laughs> oh. Turkey stirs in his sleep. Is he having a nightmare? Mad uh, Mort uh, slowly strokes his hair. He feels better. <laughs> All is well, son. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Papa. <laughs> He's such a good dad. All is well, my baby boy. <laughs> and in Turkey's mind, the dragon flies away. Because, you know, that's what was terrorizing his little childish mind. Mork yeah. whispers, Ohana meets family. <laughs> oh, God. Ah, yes, the orcish <sighs> word. The softest of smiles creeps up upon his lips. Family. Jesus Christ. 
This is what happens when you're late. We just met yesterday, and this is where we're at. <laughs> wow, that was some quick development. They just had an instant bond. So, uh, what what is the procedure here for missing somebody? I don't know how this works. Um, well, well she's going to be here. In I like mean, she five said five minutes, minutes so that's that was not a true. Seven, seven minutes ago should have been the latest. Well, okay. if, we'll give her a couple more minutes. If she's not here, then we'll just start. Thumbs so everybody's week. Oh. It's Friday. Happy Friday. Oh, my God. Good. Where is the time going? Oh. Time keeps on slipping into the future. Oh, oh my no. God. Halloween's so close already. What happened? Yep. What? How, how do you guys deal with trick or treaters? Do you like ignore them, put a bowl out, or like ever sit by your door? Or, like it's my favorite uh, holiday, so I dress up mm -hmm. in my dungeon master robes. I spend about four hundred dollars on candy and stand outside with full size oh candy God. bars. Damn! Oh, wow. So you're the good house. I am the legend of my street. Oh. I speak only in <laughs> riddles and rhyme whenever the children come up, and if they answer correctly, I give them a secret one. Yeah. What's the secret one? Ah, uh, the combo Hershey's peanut butter and chocolate bar. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Dude. A couple years ago, I actually bought a bunch of small toys and I gave those out. It was pretty cool. So, like, back in my day, the cool house just gave out, like, cans of soda. <laughs> you, you, like, you just kind of shat on them, didn't you? <laughs> See, Shout all over them. I mean, I don't know about defecation, but it's my favorite holiday because it's awesome. Oh. That's where everybody plays a little D&D. That's why I like it. I buy a bag of Jolly Ranchers, and then I eat all the Jolly Ranchers, and then I get some ice, and I replace the wrappers with ice, so it's like icy Jolly Rancher, and then when I give them out, they just melt in the kid's bag. I guess I'm kind of an asshole. <laughs> honk, honk. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny to me. Just imagine my Jolly Rancher melted. I got a rock. I got a wrapper full of water. <laughs> Stay hydrated, kid. It's my song about water. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I was about to start it, but I already forgot how I started my own song. I don't know why I want to sing about water, but I'm going to do it in a second about water. Check the song about water. It's about water. Hey there, how you doing? Welcome to my Jingle Jam. Why don't you take a seat? Get back to Max Fam. You look a little parched. Can I get you a drink, Coke? Oh, no. This is coming from the same sea around here. We be sipping on a little clear. No, I don't mean a little cabbie hold your beer. So let me come on at you with a little bit of truth. Spend pure something clean. Or just to you. Gonna go up one H2O, watch it flow. Wouldn't be the first time. I want a meowy cat here. Do you hear him? No. Sometimes. Oh, you're missing it out. I hear my cat outside pawing at the door. I'm not letting him in, though. Why not? Because he sucks. How about I let my cat in, you let your cat in? Fine. What is this like? I'll show you mine if you show me yours. Cat bonders. <laughs> Get in here, fatty. Come on, buddy. Oh, you don't want uh, yes. Now? The yin and yang of cat ownership. <laughs> come here, cutie. Come, come here, fatty. Uh, you don't want to cat. come in either. Yeah. I know. I know, you <laughs> little shit brick. <laughs> Hang on one second. I got the best thing for you, pal. <laughs> Sing. <laughs> oh my god, gamers. I'm up? so sorry. Oh, you're Gucci. Don't worry oh, about it. It's okay, Cry's oh. auto tuning his cat. Oh, that's good. <laughs> no, my mom's shower broke. <laughs> oh. Well, oh, yeah, my mom's shower broke this morning. So my uncle had to put a literal, you know, like, um, what's the word for it? The English word for it. Uh, the, the, the little knobby the, the, that turns like the shower handle? No, 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 no. The water hose. 
Oh. One of those, you know, like one of those just circular twists. A valve. Yeah, a valve. valve. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, one of those. So because my mom's um, knob or whatever thing you use for her shower are broken, my uncle took the valve from outside. <laughs> Hey, whatever works, man. <laughs> Put that on as the, the little shower twisty thingy instead. That's but, very, you know. honestly, that's impressive that you <clears throat> did that in the first place. I would have said, yeah. well, I'm fucked. <laughs> yeah, uh, and it worked pretty pretty good. So that was, uh, so it took me a minute. So, like, I was trying to rush, take a shower and quick eat something really quick. I'm sorry, guys. It's all good. 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 No worry, no worries. I just waited for this all week. Do you oh, get your profile picture? <laughs> I could wait five more minutes. Uh, I don't know if I do. I can I can get it, but then I'd have to quick fix it again or crop it or whatever. Oh. I can get it for you. Check it out. Um, check it out. Here, watch you. I got you. Check it, check it, check it, check it. I just right click show handout and then I'll just do a really quick crop for you. Bam, and then you can just save this pick right here. Wow, we, wow, we. Chat, uh, chat dropped a smart joke. <gasps> oh no! What did they do? When a shower is broke, it lacks liquidity. Ah, uh, chat! Come on, come that on! Was, that was a tasty pun. Well done. Alrighty. All right, all right. Let me let me save this image and then pull that up and then. Huh? Oh, okay. Oh baby, here we go. Oh baby, oh baby, oh <laughs> baby. Before we start, I want everyone to know the Digimon Cyber Sleuth game is great. Okay, that's all I had to say. Nice. Wow, wowee. I know. I'm rushing, I'm rushing, I'm rushing. I'm not mad at you, by the way. Why what did I do, Russ? Last week what did you I said do? you said a bit of the bubbly and it's been stuck in my head all week. A little bit of the bubbly. A little bit of the bubbly. <laughs> You're so welcome. And then I watched fucking, yeah. what is it, old school wrestling reviews all week. Oh, did you? You should have watched Botchamania. That one's my, uh, that's my second favorite. I'm so sorry I did this to you. My favorite wrestler is the Ultimate Warrior because he's so fucking intense, dude. The Iron Sheik yeah, the also time. intense. Dude. <laughs> fucking bullshit, man. Yeah, you fucking bullshit. <laughs> Are you okay? I'm all right. You're right. I'm just uh, I'm just going through withdrawal because we haven't actually started yet. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm loading like, oh, it all up. I'm loading it's a, it's it. It's okay. Oh. I'm not angry or anything. I'm just no. It's okay. You can be I'm angry. Just I just really disappointed. No, as oh he did. As me only and cry. I like actively tried to set up all my audio stuff last night too, and like test it out with them. And be like, guys, does this sound all right? And everything, like, because I was ready, and then the shower broke. <laughs> it's all good. It all I'm blew up. sorry. You ever see a? You ever see like a like a Nosferatu that's been exsanguinated or like a heavily desiccated man? That's what I am right now. Oh, I'm sorry. Goodness. Uh, can you, for just convenience sake, can you copy and paste the info again that for me to log in so I don't have to scroll since I'm on a laptop and using a touchpad? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Let me do that for you. First. By the way, it's 420 me, in the East of the Coast, by I'm the putting way. That, I'm putting that in real quick, but ignore that. That's not what you need. Uh, hold on. I have, to, I have to throw out my BRB screen so that people don't dox me. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Wait, you're you're going to have to load up the really long loading for the map tools, right? Uh, it, it's not uh, as long after the first time. But it's, it's the first time for, uh, yeah. For this new computer, who this? Who, oh. Yeah. I think it'll be okay. Perfect Day time for the intro. It is long. <laughs> Don't let yourself <laughs> It's okay, guys. I'm just, a, I'm just a, the hot mess. Everybody hurts. Oh my God. I'm sorry. <laughs> Five hours today, right? Listen, I just restarted my computer for like 45 minutes yesterday. I don't, I'm, I'm all good with. As long as you need to get what you need. I'm mm. coming for you, Toro. It's, it's all good. It's all good. I'm just gonna I'm play. Coming. I'm just gonna play this. Time for intros. <laughs> oh, I bought a 
like garlic min mincer. I want to try it. So you bought oh. garlic what? Mincer. mincer. Yeah, it was. Those like, things are cool. Yeah, it's like this like stainless steel thing, and like a little garlic in there, and you're just like brush it down, and it's like bam, yep. and this is right there. It's I like, have one oh. of those. It's so sick. Wait, do you have? Do you have the one that like rolls, or the two handles that you squish together? Squish. I have the squish one as well. I thought that this was like a standard thing that literally every house had. Is it not like a very normal thing to have? I always just chopped my garlic with a knife. I, I always ramen. just chopped. <laughs> I don't think I ever ate fresh garlic growing up. Dude, fresh garlic is so nice. Or fresh vegetables. <gasps> okay, Wait, it's Were you just doing a, the... a meat eater? You, you oh, no, no, no. I was, I was in a very poor house. Oh, I see, I see. Ramen. Me too, thanks. That, that was how I was too. I mean, we had potatoes, thankfully. I, I didn't have like ingredients and shit until I actually started cooking myself. I know, right? Like, <laughs> you're like, wow, you could actually buy that stuff from the produce aisle? Wowie. Yeah, right. Wowie. All right, it, it's almost done. I'm loaded. 160 at 175. 163. 64, 65. 66. 70. My mom was a manager at McDonald's, so that was pretty much just what we ate all the time. My brother worked at mid at Wendy's, so that's what I got all the time. And he used to steal the toys from me too, so that I'd have all of them. Aw, best bro. <laughs> best bro. All right, I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Oh, thank goodness. Well, now, 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 it is time to get started. Sunlight peers through the nearby windows, just barely through the darkened black haze of the smog that surrounds Bleak. A morning has come, dark and cold, but morning nonetheless. And so, our story continues. You may all awaken and make your way down into the common area when ready. Uh, 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 oh, oh, hello, Pop Pop. I remember my dream of breakdancing, oh. and I try to breakdance in my room before I leave. <laughs> it goes just a smidge better. <laughs> Neve has a waking terror. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me... Okay, obviously you guys aren't, like, rolling down the stairs. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Prove it! I mean... <laughs> I'd rather morning. not... I'm just All right. retired. <laughs> as, the, go to as the two greenskins uh, re-enter the tavern's main common area, you notice that there are a few new faces. First, you see a man in a very ridiculous-looking hat, looking around with a kind of a buck tooth smile. And you also see a very frustrated-looking deep gnome, or Snurf Neblin, if you will. Sit it here. <gasps> He's cute. Do we know what the heck a deep gnome is? Um, well, you know what a gnome is. Uh, a deep gnome is essentially gnomes from the underworld. Oh. Which, in this oh. case, the underworld is in reference to the cavernous underground of the uh, of the continent of Calcutesh. It's basically my version of the Underdark. Wait, do deep gnomes use deep speech? <gasps> Actually, they use undercommon. Is, wait, what's the difference? Well, deep speech is the language of illithids, uh, aboliths, really bad shit. Oh. But they also might speak deep speech as well. That is where it's from, though. You're on the right track. Hmm. Wait. The language of the hag's deep speech in brackets under common is what you said. Correct, which means you can speak his language. Oh. Winky face. <laughs> please, please, no. <laughs> please help. <laughs> while they're uh, while they are downstairs beginning to mingle, mm -hmm. I'm going to spend the next uh, 10 minutes making my bed and being upset that it's not perfect <laughs> and redoing it over and over again. Awesome. Mm. Eventually, you get that hospital corner right. Thank perfect. God. 
All right. All right, as uh, you walk out of your door, you see Roz uh, does the worm out of her room and <laughs> on the stairs. Yarg, I need me morning. <laughs> and then on smash through the window. Ahoy, mates. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hello. Good morning. Hello. <gasps> oh. You guys mingle while I answer the phone real quick. Tor will wait for phone call. What is phone? Hold on. Tor has broken rule. <laughs> yep, there he is. Oh no. <laughs> Don't trust no one, not even yourself. Oh god. Torl greets you this morning. Torl hopes that you slept well. Torl must now perform his daily blink. You. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Torl is refreshed. That looked painful. Life is pain. Just gonna Life sit is suffering. here. And He'll slowly to start to. Pour a drink, but for who? I'm gonna walk over by uh, Mr. Knuckles, kind of give him a nod, and then wait for everybody else. Oi, it's the sensible one! Oh, right, take Mr. a seat. Knuckles, are you buying us breakfast? Ah, uh, sure, whatever. Just breakfast put it on my grog. Just put it on okay, my tab, Toral. Breakfast grog. Toral keeps tabs on everyone. Wow, even me? Wow, okay. Best Lord friend. want one beer, one ale. <laughs> he will give everyone their breakfast ale slash grog slash secret admirations. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hold on. This fucking sleazy guy comes walking up. Uh. <clears throat> hey, Mr. Knuckles. Uh... Why are you throwing out free drinks? Maybe throw a little bit towards your gold palette. No! Back off, you scum sucking fuck whistle! That's not very nice to say to your old friend, would you say? Just a little bit of the piper? Just a little bit of the kiss of the angels? Just a little bit? Please! The angels sing! I need just a little bit! Please! Mork doesn't like oh, sounds. No. All right, then. No. Kind of lean in, Mr. Sound. Knuckles, and go, what, uh, what was that about? I just let him. Don't pay him no mind. He's got one of the best hands in the business when it comes to taking stuff. But, uh, he's... He's, you know, he's addicted to the poppy and all that. Interesting, uh, interesting companions you keep, I gotta say. They're not really my companion. You know, you can't really choose your business partners, I guess. You deal with what's near you. I guess if it works, it works. Aye. Aye, you lot get your drinks. We got business to discuss. Uh, uh, Mr. Torl, can you put breakfast in grog, please? <laughs> Torl is analyzing the inquiry. Do you wish for alcohol for breakfast? Or would you yeah. like me to put the breakfast yeah. in your alcohol? Uh, uh, <laughs> I want, you get grog, and then you put breakfast in, in grog. It's, it's, like a soup. Breakfast grog. Toro will look into your mind and will ascertain the meaning. Arigato gozaimasu. De nada. I'm sorry, I got me. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> <God, laughs> <fucking> <laughs> 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 not. 
I'm laughing at this with funny stuff. <laughs> <laughs> We broke the DM! Yes! Yes. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> Someone uh. needs to keep tally of it. So, like, the first, this is the first one today. Yep, yep, Alright, yep. Tora will then pour your eggs into your fucking frog. Ew! <laughs> Ew! And then he'll, uh, he'll, he'll, like, take a sausage and he'll take a little knife and cut a hole directly through the center and give you a sausage straw. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Mm. Uh, I'm uh, Turkey's gonna take a nice uh, thick sip of this <laughs> breakfast grog. Uh, there's a lot of like you can see the grease just pillowing him out of his lips, you know, as he's like sipping me down. Oh. Mm. Tastes like home. Thank you. How how many dollar dollar bills, y'all? Mr. Knuckles said he had it covered. It is paid for already. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're welcome. Fruit. Toral has many fruits. Which <laughs> fruits would you like? Maple. Maple? Maple? <laughs> and bananas. She just wants a pure <laughs> thing of maple syrup. And a little bit of the bubble. He will give you an apple. <laughs> And then he'll take it back and kind of, kind of carve one piece out of it and then give it back to you. <laughs> what is he doing? Why is he doing that? That is what his translation of apple. <laughs> <laughs> it's like an apple, but different. <laughs> God. I love I reach out so much. for the full slice or for the full apple. Tor will take, take the, Tor, Tor will give the piece to you. I take the piece. He just wishes for his customer's satisfaction. <laughs> I don't exactly understand, so I take the piece, I nod, and I leave. He hopes that you are happy. That's all he wants, is to make people happy. After all the lives he ruined in the war. Oh no! <laughs> Tor will reflect on his memories. All he sees are the faces of the men he killed. <laughs> Yar har 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 har. And then, Ahoy, best friend. Hope will enter his eyesight <laughs> as the light of his dawning life enters the room. <laughs> Toro will feel a strange sense of peace as the screams of his comrades mute. A smile will attempt to assault his face, but will fail as the palisades of his depressive sadness still yet oppress his cheeks. Toro will give you a little wave with his weird hand. <laughs> <laughs> My ribs hurt already, you guys. We, already, we, we haven't even been doing this for like 10 minutes and I'm already I'm, I'm hurting already. <laughs> Good morning, matey. May I have my morning grog? <laughs> Do you also wish for breakfast, grog? No, thank you, meat. You're uh. missing out. <laughs> Toro will then reach down, but will stop. He will then turn and go to his good glasses. <laughs> oh, shit. And he will pull out a pristine <laughs> crystal mug. <gasps> he will then oh. pour the cold grog into the crystalline mug. I will put it on the table in front of you. His eyes watch your every movement. Anticipation <laughs> upon his lips. He's, he's watching me salivate currently, looking at this tasty grog. He will uh, scoot it a little closer to you. <laughs> and will turn the handle in an inviting <laughs> gesture to grip, to grasp it. <laughs> I slowly reach out with excitement and anticipation, and I slowly move the, the this nice fancy ass cup to my lips. Ah, matey, that's a good one. That's a good one for the books. Toro's eyes glistened with purpose. He will then become kind of awkward. <laughs> 
<laughs> just now. Yeah, just, yeah, just now. <laughs> and we'll uh, look at this corner. <laughs> oh no! Arr, arr, arr. Thank you, matey. And I slowly reach out to give him a gentle pet. <laughs> Once again, the hand <laughs> breaks the threshold of his protective bar. His defenses hold strong against all emotion, save for the hand of Ra. <laughs> <laughs> it reaches out, piercing the can <laughs> piercing the enigma of sadness that <laughs> traps this poor soul. And for one brief moment, the sun shines as a head is pat and a soul is healed. You know, I think Toro's got some issues. <laughs> <laughs> ah, thank you, matey. I'll come say goodbye to you, but currently I have work. Toro will nod ever so slightly. His empty har, gaze har. follows oh, Raz's footsteps. Har, 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 har. <laughs> she flatulates. <laughs> <laughs> Toro does not understand the significance. <laughs> <laughs> I really meant for him to be a serious character. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you did. <laughs> well, that was a really long purchase of a drink. <laughs> <laughs> just took that, the amount of time that it took you guys to describe it, that's how long it all took. <laughs> That's a lot of emotional attention in here. Uh, anyway, so let's go over your job. I got it for you. All right. He'll throw down some parchments and he'll get started. After talking with me, boss, <clears throat> here's what he wants you to do. There's a man that's going to be arriving in town this afternoon. A man by the name of, uh, let's see here, Cortis Stone, I believe. Cortis Stone uh, is some kind of mage. I'm not really sure what kind. You'll have to look into that, too. But, long story short, my boss wants the scroll case he's carrying. That's it. You get that scroll case to me, and you can consider that mission done. You get this oh. done, that's 500 gold for each of you. How heavy is it? Well, it, it, I think it's one of the big ones, so, I don't know, like, like an axe. Can you tell us about him? Unfortunately, we don't actually know that much about him. I know he's from the Wizards Guild, so he's probably some sort of mage. Uh, I know that he's got money. Uh, he hired two uh, mercenaries. We haven't been able to find out their names either, but he definitely hired them. I like how you can throw your voice around. Oh, yeah, thank you. Uh, so, other than that, um, the only thing we know is that he'll be in town soon. Probably this afternoon. Now, there is one person we know he is coming to meet. Uh, one of these big, fat, noble... Uh, what's his name here? And he'll look through the, the documents. Ah, oh, yeah. Foley Furs is his name. What was that? Foley Furs? Foley Furs. How do you, how do you spell that? Here, let me write it down on this parchment for you. <clears throat> do you, boss, want... Uh, scroll case and scroll, or just case? I think he wants the case and whatever's inside it, so, you know. Oh, so it might not even be scroll inside. It might not be, who knows. But we know Are that... Look? I mean, if I'm you really want... About stuff. I mean, if you want, that's fine, but, you know, it's magic stuff, so yeah, just don't get cursed. Speaking <laughs> of that, do we know anything actually about the contents of what he's carrying? Uh, no. The boss just wants it. So... Do I recognize the name? Uh, give me a one. history check. History... <laughs> Man, your breakdancing in history is just not good today. No. Uh, you do not know the name. Okay. You especially don't know the history of breakdancing. <laughs> When did it start? Or all she know. knows, she invented it. Oh, yeah, wow. Maybe. I thought I invented the word de bomb when I was in fourth grade. I didn't. <laughs> I heard it on the radio. 
So uh, how do you propose that we acquire said materials from this gentleman? It's up to you. You can choose however you want to do it. The boss doesn't care. But uh, keep in mind that, uh, you know, if you're off him and you get caught by the guards, we don't know each other. It's not going to come to that. You said Foley Furs was a local. What do we know about him? Uh, he's some noble asshole. Uh, let's see here. He's... Uh, let's see here. He sells... Oh, yeah, he's the guy that owns all those fancy tailor shops. He's uh, fashionable or whatever. Can I have your music box? What? Your music box. <laughs> Alright, I'll silence that my phone. That was my fault, sorry. Oh, it was your... Oh. I no, I mean, it was his phone, but I made his phone do that by mistake. Oh. Can I see it? Sure. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> hands, hands you... <laughs> Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. <laughs> I don't think it's okay. Kind of really concerned right now. Cease. <laughs> I'm really fucking scared right now. <laughs> Torl can see into your thoughts. <laughs> what? No! <laughs> you can't start thinking about thoughts of me because then Torl's gonna know and he's gonna kung fu punch you into the next fucking realm. All right, so uh, do we have an idea of wh when he was coming again? You said he was coming here soon, right? All right, this afternoon. A uh, couple hours, maybe. And where uh, would we run into him again? Well, we've got word that he's going to be going towards the alchemical district. Uh, I've got a contact there that you could speak to who might be able to set you up better. Uh, see here, his name's uh, Tommy Two Hands. That sounds like a reputable fellow. And do we have any uh, information on what this man looks like? Or should we get it from uh, your... Yeah, uh, Tommy, no. Yeah, just ask all two right. hands. Right. All right, that's all I got. But Anyone how else? many feet? <laughs> Valid question. Don't laugh. Well, he's got two feet, I think. Okay. Good. <laughs> if he use magic that. hand, is he point. three hands? No, he's called Tommy Two Hands. Okay. Maybe How maybe many? he's missing one hand and he uses mage hand to have a second hand. No, he's got two hands. That's why he's called Tommy Two Hands. Oh. <laughs> two hands. Ooh, well, I'm not it... called Neve Two Hands. I mean, do hands? people call you that? No. Well, then you're not called Neve Two Hands. <laughs> <laughs> you got a point. My first name is not Mad. Oh. <gasps> Me used to just be more. Yarg means it's just he's just trying to imply that he steals shit. Let's move on. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> oh, Your sh name is Mr. Knuckles, and that's because you have knuckles. I'm no, gonna start I moving <laughs> toward the door. <laughs> I wanna be Mr. Knuckles sometimes. I have knuckles. Hey, 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 I, hey. all right, dude, just from looking at him, I feel like his breath smells. Is this true? No, it's awful. <laughs> uh, he is a disgusting and I, human I, being. I kind of cover my mouth, but and, and he goes, oh, 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 I, 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 what, 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 what? You got, uh, you got any spells? Oh. <laughs> what do you? I, what, like for sale? What do you think that? Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to buy some spells. Do you know what a spell is? Yes, it's, uh, it's what you put on parchment. Uh, yeah, sure. What are you looking to buy? Let's well, see. I wanna, I wanna buy a spell that makes me handsome. Oh. Neve, go save her. Neve, go save him. Uh, yeah, Scott. I might have one of those in the, in the back. I can. I could go look for one. He'll look at your ass. <laughs> Wait. I've seen you do that. No. I've seen you give that spell to someone before. It worked so well. Uh, you know that one chap, he was so handsome after you gave him that spell. Yes, and I have it in the back. Not in my back, the back of the of the storage, and I will go get that for you, sir, if that is what you are looking for. Oh, thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. You're welcome. 
See, I, I don't know anything about you or who you are or whatever, but I, I know that you could really use a spell. I just like burst through the door, super like rushed. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. As you as you walk this way, uh, the um, this in this gnome will just begin to go. Uh, well, he'll. He, he lets out a frustrated sigh. Oh my god, it is going to happen! I can sense it! I just glance back at him and just go, Ugh, just just not another one. I'm gonna keep walking. <laughs> my quest line will never be finished. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. It's okay. I understand. That's what he would have done, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, it's fine, it's fine. That's the cursed table. And man. so I sit here waiting for... <laughs> <laughs> the corner of the forgotten characters. <laughs> I yeah. Anyway, <clears throat> did you say that you had a spell, love? Uh, no, that mage does. I've just seen it in action before. Oh, did it? Spectacular spell, really. You mean I could be handsome? Uh, yes, you could, but you aren't. But uh, if oh, was, you will be. It always hurts to hear the truth. It does. But the handsomeness is the only thing I can't steal. See, you can change your truth. You can. How? Yes. Um, with a spell, or you can believe in yourself. Are you saying that if I believe in myself, clean myself up, get a nice pair of shoes, and maybe? Maybe have a brighter outlook or, or be more handsome? Y yes, and maybe brush your teeth. <laughs> that would be time. good. Thank you so much. A good start. Thank you so much. <laughs> How could I ever repay your kindness? You can brush your teeth, please. <laughs> I, I, I will. I will. I promise. I promise I will. I'll, I'll, I'll the sooner the better. I'll poke out all my boils too. Drain them dry. No. I will. Go do that. <laughs> all right. Hey, excuse me, Mr. Toro. I'd like to purchase your finest bath. <laughs> your finest. <laughs> My God. Is it the whole bath? Very well. I don't have any money. <laughs> Leave. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Toro. Arr, what a stinky mate that was. Oh, I'll, just, oh. I'll just sit here in my own self pity, I will. Hmm. Hey, uh, mate, he said to leave, not to sit. No, he meant leave his presence. Correct. All right, all right. He always lets me sit here because he's got a heart of gold, he does. Negative. <laughs> Toro's heart is made of flesh and sadness. <laughs> and glass. <laughs> oh. What? Oh. oh. For it shatters so easily. Oh. Oh. Fragile. So Handle with care. <laughs> <laughs> He's like Rorschach. A riff off of Sheena, dude. Uh, <laughs> I'll just make it easier for you. Handle with care. <laughs> oh, all right, anyways. Hey, yo. Hey, hey uh, I said I was gonna say goodbye, and that's what I'm gonna do. One more grog for the road, please. <laughs> Grab clean pour spell. <laughs> Excuse me? Grab clean pour present. Oh, grab clean. Arr, arr, arr. Thanks, matey. I will see you later. Toro will count the moments. <laughs> <laughs> well, how long is a moment? <laughs> Two. A heartbeat. I take Two. my I take my glass and I take a, a hearty stroll Seven and wave minutes. in my hand. Up to say goodbye one last time. I love that song. Shut up! Oh, sorry. 
You stink! Go get some money and take a shower! You stink! <laughs> you almost right, sounded like the scout from TF2 there. That that's fine. That was pretty good. Was like, you know who I am? I'm a force of nature. <laughs> if you was from where I was from, you'd be fucking dead. <laughs> I love it. Huh. Um, oh my as, goodness. Yeah, as uh, Turkey was leaving, uh, the the little the little boyo caught caught his eye, uh, and he sat down as he's looking towards him. Oh. Brother? What? No, no, oh, oh, my, oh my goodness, it is so good to see somebody show some interest. All Please, right, you must on. help me, sir. And I, gr I grab him and I carry him with me. Wait, I'm oh, being what? accosted! Please <laughs> help me! All right, guys, I brought my brother with us. What the hell is that? What? Are you what? assaulting young little man? Unhand oh. me this instant! No, this is my- Turkey, that is not just Put him as down. Love. But, uh, and then I put him down. He will okay. scurry over here. <laughs> and I thought you were a kindly green skin that would help me. No one will help me. <laughs> uh, what? I, I, I mean, I didn't say I wouldn't. I just, I thought oh, you were my brother. Little one, do you know where Carter's stone is? Carter? Car no. You are no use. <laughs> oh, oh, gods, please, someone help me. <laughs> what, what is wrong, little brother? <laughs> Your big Onicha is here to save you. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Daynata. <laughs> he speaks the language. <laughs> and he, he will then say, please, someone's stolen my cart. All of my possessions are gone. What kind of possessions? I'm ruined. All of the, all of my product given to me by my great grandfather, Exquisite Buble Swinslow backslash and fourth the fifth. Oh, that's a big name. Thank you. We're very proud of it. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> okay. Well, where, where, I like um. Where'd they go? I was where? coming into town last night. I was going to stock up at the inn for a rest before I went to the market. And when I woke up this morning, it was stolen from the stables. When I asked good Satoral if he knew what happened, he told me that he had slept for the first time in many years. <laughs> wow. So therefore he did not see what had happened. I asked him why he did not sleep for so long. He just stared up at the, at the stairs and told me, an angel was here. <laughs> that sounds uh, wonderful. <laughs> Please, won't anyone help Exquisite Team Boo play Switch Low Backslash and Fourth the Eight? I mean, I'll do anything for family. But we are not family. <laughs> Don't Whatever tell you me. say, brother. <laughs> He's not gonna Listen, believe him. <laughs> my little friend. <laughs> yeah. Do you have any uh, any idea of where we could even go to begin well, to help you? <laughs> well, all I know is, is that there was a red bandana left behind, and he'll hold up a red bandana. This is the only device. clue that I have. Did you say device? Device. <laughs> That's the only one you get. <laughs> another, another one of those and I'm coming down on you cry play by the rules I, that was in my thought that was in my thoughts though it's okay it didn't come out of my character's head it's fine it's okay wait so uh, there was a red bandana left behind yes that, it's the only clue that... I have doesn't that strike you as very strange? Why would they leave behind an article of clothing? Not like well, that can just fall off. I don't think it was red before. Oh. You know, he'll hold up a bloodied bandage. Ooh. Oh, that's definitely different. Yeah, I'm mm. gonna reach oh. out and like like put it to my like lips to see no. if it tastes like anything. Okay. With Tasty that he will he will start to move away from Ah uh, He will no longer look as if he's being helped. <laughs> 
Now he is not entirely convinced that you are the ones that stole it. <laughs> Yar, I'm sorry. Yar, I'm sorry for my ill-mannered friends here. What is any, it? Any like? other clues? Uh, <laughs> Don't answer it, that. It tastes like blood. This is blood. Yes. Yeah, we got that. yeah we... Just so you know, this is not juice. He is not a liar. And I throw it. <laughs> I, I, I toss it towards his feet. He will catch it because it is very precious as it is a clue to what happened to his entire fortune. <sighs> okay, where was your uh, card that was stolen? My card was in the stables of the inn. I followed the trail of my wagon's tears into the stonework. They tore off very quickly. The only clue that I have is it led to the alchemical district. But I can't go there but on the account of the rampant racism. <laughs> The what races? The rampant. Ramp, the rampant races. Have you seen this place? Ra this is oh, rampant. Oh, racism. Oh. I I racism. A racism. What's a rampant? <laughs> you remember Speak when they out. had man on stake? Oh. We helped him. They were racist against him. Oh, that was a rampant? That was a little rampant. Yes. Okay. <laughs> that was a one whole <laughs> rampant. Alright, my good man, I, I, I don't know if we can do much to help you, but... If we find anyone that could perhaps match a description, or we see someone who's sporting a fat wound or something, maybe we can try to help, but we have something to do, and if we happen to run into it along the way, we'll uh, give it some attention, but that's all we can offer. Oh, thank you. If you retrieve my goods, there's a reward in it for you. How much? He will hold up a big-ass <laughs> diamond. Oh. oh, I'm just gonna oh. say, it. like, guys, this is like... That the, he got an illegal thing that happened to him. We should probably like prioritize this thing, like, because our thing is like temporary. Like, we can deal with it another time. Give me later. some arcana. It is a mission from the goddess. It is not arcana? temporary. Did I get a what? Arcana check arcana on that check. diamond. Okay. Mork believed it to be just a dime. Oh Turn my god. Just wow. Sweet oh. Jesus Christ, please. Are, all right, okay, okay, let me do it. Let me save the day. You're my only hope, Sheena. I know, let me save the day. Hang on. This the ends the storyline unless you figure it out. I know. Hang I on. do magic good. Hang on, how do I... Uh, how do you I You click You click on your token, and then you go to skill check, and you click that, and then you go to the drop-down bar and select Arcana. Yeah, because mine's not coming. Oh, shit. I forgot to add the the Windows stuff that you wanted me to add. Oh, yeah, that's right, because you have a new that's, computer. Because I have the, the laptop, yeah. So Go up to, the window. Go up to window yeah. and make yep. sure that selected and initiative are added. Pray, uh, that's pray, why I was like, pray. I can't see some of this stuff. <laughs> Bring so yeah, hard so right liked it. There we go. Now I can see. Wow. Okay, so. She's going to do it. Do I believe it. in her. You do it. You're a pirate. You know booty. Come on. And a one. And what was it? Uh, Arcana. Arcana. Come on. Oh, I don't even. Come on. Hang on. Oh. And, and wait, I didn't do that. I didn't oh. do it correctly. Sorry. Skill check. I'm sorry. I'm remembering how to do all this. You can do it. I believe in you. So oh! Ah! 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 <laughs> and so the story continues. Oh! <laughs> All right, oh, Rise. <laughs> Rise, you know that the diamond is worth 5,000 gold pieces. Ooh. It is incredibly rare to find a diamond this intact. In fact, it is so rare that they are sought because of the fact that they are the required component in spells that raise the dead. Whoa. <gasps> oh. Anybody got a dead family member? Look at, look at the look at the booty. That's a good one right there. We need to help this man. I mean, right. okay. It's my brother anyway, so I'm going to have to. Can I see the uh, If it gets us closer to doing the mission, then fine. I mean, we're going there anyway, so. Okay. Did you ask him something, Naomi? Yeah, can I see the bandana? He will give the bandana to you. Looking at it, does it... Y y you know how when you tie something very tightly and you knot it and you untie it, then you can see where the knots have mm -hmm. been? Can I tell if it's been like wrapped around their uh, someone's head or arm or something? It is definitely an armband, but you notice something else that the others did not. There is a oh. symbol written in Thieves' Cant. Ooh. Oh. The symbol of Thieves' Cant reveal 
that this was a bandana belonging to the new hand. The new hand? Indeed. Is, is this just someone's name and or title, or is this like a... a... Well, <clears throat> from what little you do know, uh, from the knowledge of the right people, there is said to be a civil war going on in Bleak right now between the huh. Ledgermane, which the Ledgermane is the king of thieves. Mm -hmm. uh, so let me give you a quick rundown of, of thief lore. <clears throat> so each city that's large enough is ruled by a dawn. And all of the Dons are ruled by the Ledgermane. The Ledgermane is an elected position, quotations, the elected, um, that essentially indicates that not only does all thievery protected by thieves banding together and following a certain code of conduct, but more importantly, the Ledgermane also serves as the head priest of Sekulkus. Mm. As of right now, however, there has not been a Ledgermane in nearly 30 years. So, Sekulkus is the god of thievery, right? Luck. Uh, Sekulkus is the god of thieves, luck, and beggars. Okay, I call him Sekul Dekul. <laughs> so there's there's currently a war going on to determine the new one. Uh, more of like uh, a political war. struggle. Okay. It's not open war, but there has been plenty of. I mean, it's rogue, so there's plenty of stabbing, but <laughs> it's not like an open yeah. war thing. But well, you okay. said between the Ledgermane and... And then you didn't say no, between uh, the... No, for, for the Ledgermane, between oh, okay, factions, okay. yeah. Okay. Specifically, the New Hand is one such faction that's probably vying to get a Ledgermane place. Basically, the Ledgermane mm -hmm. decides the code that all thieves mm -hmm. follow. Okay. Well, this is an armband, and uh, it belongs to a thief. Wait, how do you know that? Is it a symbol that's like visible or? or, or I mean, yeah, they're I they're just it. gonna see some weird symbol. Like it won't mean anything okay. to them. See, that's how thieves I, can't works. It yeah, uses I, symbology and like, you know, innuendos, metaphors, and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I point to fell the off a truck. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I point to the symbol. Uh, this right here. This is a, a thief clan, if you will. Huh. Oh, I did not know that. That's very interesting. Thief? Tommy Two Hands is yeah, I mean, we gotta go talk to him anyway. Well, we'll let you know if we get your cart back. Oh, thank you so much. I will wait here in the inn in a panicked state. You're doing that very well. Thank All you. Right, let's go. And, and as, uh, before we leave, I want to, like, stand in the doorway, uh, and then just, like, lock eyes with, uh, Hollow. And just, like, you know, pose in the doorway like a, a fucking fashion model. Be like, Wait, you know, who? trying to give him uh, the, the hollow, the the man with the eye patch. Okay. You know, oh, give, no. him, give him that that the feeling of like hope, that anticipation, like maybe maybe today. You know, he stands up. You know, there there's like there there's sun shining behind me. <laughs> you know, I'm I'm combing my fingers through. I my need hair. a hero. <laughs> uh, Fuck me. Not today. <laughs> <laughs> I will commit Sudoku. <laughs> 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 All right, so uh, walk to Alcamago District. Again. Yeah, hold on. Let me if Cart Thief was hurt and bleeding, maybe he go to doctor. Mm, maybe, maybe he eat berries, feel better. Maybe he went oh. to an alchemist for a potion to heal it. Have you ever seen the spell Goodberry? Mm, what that it's look delicious. Like? <laughs> like a pie. Oh, make pie of good berries. Ooh, good berry pie. Maybe put chicken. Mm, chicken, chicken berry pie. pie. That's a good uh, chicken berry pie. Uh, uh, more uh, congery. Uh, want more breakfast grub? Oh, me have ration. <laughs> want some? <laughs> Welcome Too to bad. a new city district. <laughs> Handcrafted for your enjoyment. Ah. Uh, In five to ten minutes. <laughs> yep, seventy-one of ninety for me. Looking good. This one shouldn't take yeah, that long. Yeah, this one was fast. Yeah, this one should be small. Because it uses a lot of the same cached uh, resources. So. So we already got them. 
as we go, like under every little shadow that I pass by, I look a little more human every time, like brown hair, you know, normal eyes, everything like that. You got it. Also, welcome to town. What do you music? Oh, uh, I'm boy. still stop I'm loading in. So I am too sadly. I'm at 75 of 90 though. I'm only at 40. Dang, I'm almost well, done. Well, new she didn't laptop. Have any of the previously this? cash stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. That would be because she's not at her current normal home of residence. No. This is new for all of us though. Is well, some of it was cash though. Wait, so, from what I understand, is this building, like, on top of, like, a hill? Or, like, a cliff or something? Correct. Okay. I like it. I also like the Oblivion music. <laughs> Thank bless. You. Bless. RNG bless. Hashtag hands up. <laughs> okay, I'm good. God, I love D and D, dude. <laughs> I'm almost there. I'm at sixty-one. Just wait until video games are good enough to be able to do D and D in the game engine. Dude, we're right here. It's dude, happening. Wait. Well, like you know, first person. It's just like somehow oh. automated, generally and shit, like like automatically and shit. I was so excited. Is that good? I was so excited for Divinity's Dungeon Master mode. Yeah. Oh, and then uh and then I started I made my first campaign and then they updated it and removed half the assets. Why? Because they didn't want people to use them. So they removed like all the all the animated effects, like everything. Like Aww. I I, I must have spent a week straight in Dungeon yeah, Master. Yeah, I, I, I love messing with that. It was so fun. Yep. Wait, why did why they, would they remove that? Like, they, like... I I guess because they wanted to plan out like a DLC thing. For oh, that dumb. or something. You gotta sell the know. packs, man. I don't know, man. Sell the content. I, all I know pack. is I instantly lost all desire to do it once, like I had all my work stolen from me. Basically, mm -hmm. feels. I mean, bad. reasonable. I mean, no, I'm not angry at them, but I just lost the will to do it again because. I'm at 83. One thing I really liked also was uh, Neverwinter had a dungeon maker thing. Also, that was really fun. Oh, I yeah. made a few dungeons in that. Oh, you mean the MMO one? Yeah, the MMO. Yeah, that was the. Yeah, I really like that, actually. You can, like, name all the NPCs, make a little story and all that. Oh. Mm hmm And people good, do them as quests. Yeah. Anywho. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, wait. Yeah. Uh, 84. 85, 86. Close, actually. Maybe. You can just start. I mean, just start. Like, it's... As you wish. All uh, right. 87. Yeah, just start. <laughs> as the party enters the northern uh, section of Bleak, you travel for about an hour through the bustling city streets of the early morning. Even though it is morning, the sky is still darkened from the constant pollution and smog. The air difficult to breathe, except for this area. It actually feels rather clean up here. You can even see that the sky is a little bit clear. Although, it is still the dank darkness of bleak. As you cross through the northern gate, the guards do not give you uh, any second thought, as these guards seem to be used to people coming and going through the noble district. And as you walk up the black steps upon the asphalt road, it is there, leaning kind of casually against a city lamppost, you see this individual. Oh. <gasps> no meta. <laughs> All right. I mean, I'm just going to assume, but yeah, and let's... He has uh... two hands. <laughs> he does have two hands. As, no you, uh, as you start to approach, he'll wave you down with both hands. Okay, that may be him. Mm, he, does, he, he does have two Hello. hands. And they'll kind of disappear into this side alley here. Oh. I'm going to wait for everyone to go before following. <laughs> go forward, meat shields. What a nerd. <laughs> I can't move. Looks like you've got two hands. Thanks. As Yay. you uh, as you approach, he'll immediately switch to thieves can't, and then he'll be like, "Hey, so what's the deal? What's going on, eh? You the ones us were waiting for, us? Oh, we're looking for someone named Tommy Two Hands. Oh, it's got two hands right here, I do. All right, cool. So you're the right one. Let's switch back to comments of these these fucking look at these <laughs> look at these <laughs> fucks. Right. You're right. But these two seem he, so nice. Well, I figured that. 
Hey, what's up? Name's Tommy Two Hands. How you doing? Hello. I like your hands. Thank you. I keep them nice and lotioned. All right, so as you're all here, let's go straight over it, all right? Mr. Knuckles sent me word that she's going to be coming up here. You're looking for a certain somebody, eh? You're looking for, uh, what's this, wizard or something, yeah? Yeah, it's Coach of Stone. Yeah, Coach Stone, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I've only known a little bit about him, but he just got into town, and I gave him the old looksy over, and I'll tell you this is what he's got right here, all right? So pay real close attention. All right, that man's an illusionist, all right? That's what I've been able to pick up. He's one of them finger wagglers what can summon shadows and phantasms. So keep a close watch out for any of that nonsense. Uh, although he's not very capable from what I've been able to see. He's got a right slaggly body. He does pale skin, thin bones, you know, all that kind of stuff. Needs to eat a sandwich. Uh, he's got two uh, mercs with him. Uh, two sizable gentlemen. Things to keep a watch out for. One of them's a druid I know of named Gross Derek. From the sewers, he is. Summons up rats, gases, all kinds of gross shit, so don't let it get on you. Gross. And there's also uh, this new fella that came into town with the wizard. I uh, don't really know much about him. I just know he's got a fucking mustache, the likes of which I've never seen. And he's good with a rapier. All right. Um, do you know where we could uh, find his crew? Well, this is what I know. He's going to be coming up to see that uh, noble furs, right? That big-ass manor up, up on that hillock there. So you're going to be watching out for them, and you get a nice look at him. Now, keep this in mind, all right? I don't know what you're after, but this guy's locked up tight. He's got sharp eyes, and his guards know what they're doing. Hmm. He runs a bunch uh, of tailor businesses, right? How how sharp are we talking? Like cut, like metal, or it's just a... <sighs> maybe we could get in as uh, customers of a store, or hopeful employees. Aye, right. whatever whatever path you take to get to it, so whatever you got to do, I'm just here to give you the information. Right. Also, there's one more thing. Mm. I kind of look around a little bit. It kind of beckon Neve specifically a little closer. Then I'll switch to uh, Thieves' Camp. Oh, I missed. There's something we've got to go over real quick, all right? So straight up, right. you and me said we've got to pay this debt. All right, so there's a, uh, there's rumor that there's an Inquisitor going to be coming to town. Uh, what is an Inquisitor? Okay, so uh, an Inquisitor with a capital oh, I is... From... A... We talked about this, right? Mm-hmm. A little bit. Was it not that? I don't remember. I'll just go over it again. So, okay. uh, Inquisitor, with a capital I, uh, is basically a place... Um, they're these individuals from Ord. They are kind of like... Well, they're kind of like the actual Inquisition. They, like, punish people. Mm. That's their whole thing. And they punish people on behalf of Ord. Now, you are in Dalton, so they don't have as much jurisdiction, but an Inquisitor, when they see you know, evil acts or whatever they perceive as evil acts, they have been known to act without the permission of other countries and have mm. even been able to disappear. People are afraid of Inquisitors because they aren't regular lawmen. Mm -hmm. they, are they, like, outside of the law and they can, they're allowed to do all these things, or do people just fear them? They, or anything? they are not technically allowed to do the things that they do, but most people don't challenge them. Right. Because if they if you challenge them, then you then you basically challenge the church. Mm. That's kind of how it works. So they kind of like almost like official vigilantes, almost like something like that. Like they, they're mm. they're kind of closer to that. Because see, the thing is, is that um, Ord is a powerful country, and the Inquisitors are allowed uh, to work pseudo outside of the law because the different churches that all conglomerate into Ord, the the White Pantheon churches, and mm -hmm. some of the some of the Gray actually are spread out through the entirety of Calcatech. So, like, mm -hmm. I'll give you an example, just to kind of give you guys an idea of what you're dealing with. Uh, you are in Bleak, but there but there are shrines to the various good gods and also to some of the Grey. Now, Sekulcus mm -hmm. is not a part of Ord, but Eos is the goddess of adventurers and, and fairness. So, basically, whenever an Inquisitor punishes somebody, the only time they're going to be challenged is, is by another, like, adventuring-type character who's outside the normal, like, cast cast system, or, like, a high-level law person of, like, a barrister, a mayor, something like that. So, essentially, the only people that challenge Inquisitors are people that either have the weapons to do so or the clout, and normal people just don't. 
That's why they're so, like, feared. Okay. Yeah. Do you know what he's looking for? He'll lean in and he'll just say, I have no idea what he's looking for. But this here, this is this, this here Inquisitor, I've heard some things about him, all right? Mm-hmm. I heard, I heard he was with the, uh, with the heroes that took down Marcellus Kingvale. So keep a close watch. Whatever he is, he's a Billy Badass he is, and you don't want to get caught. So keep your nose clean. We'll try to do so. I thrust out the bloody handkerchief. Do you know anything about this and who it might have belonged to? I'll take a look at that. All right, let's see here. This is a symbol of the new hand. Hmm. Apparently the perpetrator of stealing someone's cart, they have a, a... Well, quite a nice prize for us if we uh, discover who it was and get his goods back. He'll scratch his chin and say, I'll tell you what, I'll hold on to this. I'll take a look into it, all right? And you meet me back here whenever you're done with your right. with your caper, all right? And I'll see what I can find. All right. Thank you. All right, then. If, if there is, like, a thank you symbol or a respect symbol. Oh, there is, and that is uh, various handshakes. Uh, as you two are of relative equal rank, and you're both from not from the same... Dawn ship, uh, your let's see. I think I actually have this. Your handshake is specifically a fist bump into a sideways hand slap, and then an elbow bop. <laughs> an elbow bop, very specifically. All right, I, I hold out my fist. All right, boom, slap, bop. <laughs> now pull it, twist it, bop it. All right, do it again, but better. All right, he'll uh, nod, and then he'll walk around the corner and just fucking swoosh. Jeez, I was going to ask him something. Love. He's uh, gone. Uh, what was that? <laughs> did, you, did you have something else you needed to ask me? Yeah, uh, just real quick. I just wanted to know if did you actually... Sorry about that. I was, yeah, it's all right. I practiced that. I, I understand. It's, a, it's definitely a rogue's way to just immediately just go into the distance very fast. Um, he just vanished, went around the corner, that's all. <laughs> All right, so do you uh, happen to have any uh, information on what Stone is actually carrying with him? All right, so I looked into that a little bit. I know it's a scroll, or a, or it's in a scroll case, but he looked afraid of it. Huh, and uh, again, how how practiced in uh, the arcane arts would you say he was? Well, I'm no wizard, mind you, but uh, I mean, he... He's either he's either good enough that he gets paid a lot, or he's in good enough that he has a lot of money. So I'm not really sure. But I mean, he doesn't look that capable, if I'm honest. Hmm. He might just be one of the rich families in uh, Majatol. Oh, that's what I was thinking. A silver spoon of his ours. Mm-hmm. All right, that's all I got. Kind of Appreciate it. Nervous. All right. Oh, a hey, uh, one more thing. Uh, kind of look around a little bit. And then he'll say, Word of advice. Do not go into the basement of that manor. Oh, I really want to go That was the into worst the thing basement. you could have said. <laughs> I glance over at <laughs> Mork and Turkey. Mm-hmm. That was the worst thing you could have said. Thank you. I agree. I think you've doomed us all. We're going to die now. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Slow <laughs> die. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's go to the basement. Right. Is scroll case down there? Maybe. <laughs> I'm sorry, this baby laughed, dude. It's like, oh, but now we're gonna die. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> There's nothing else that could possibly happen. We're just gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> right, wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, what's the plan here? Honestly, I think uh, you, the Neve Changeling Lady, I think you should. Uh, well, you seem to be the most proficient with this kind of thing. No, <laughs> you're not really making it very uh, secret. Let's be real here. I, I mean, other normal people might hear. <sighs> well, what do you suggest we do? Um. So this man in the ma- in the mansion, he owns a lot of tailor shops, correct? That's what he said. Maybe we could do something with that. Either pretend to be very upset customers or try to gain employment. 
while so you, you can get close to the person that Stone is going to visit. While you guys are doing this, I'm gonna walk back and like just keep. You're gonna keep talking, but I'm just gonna like care, uh, casually carry uh, Arg back up here. Oh, what are we? Group. Oh, yeah. All right, that's fair. <laughs> I'm just gonna <laughs> glance over and see. <laughs> <laughs> ah, sorry, so I'm carrying a pirate lady, and just, ah. you know, this is normal now. The, 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 the grog, it hit me a little too hard. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And then I slap myself in the face a little. I understand. <laughs> Wait, so are you suggesting that, like, one of us go in there as, as a customer? What if Lady of Many Faces becomes one of the mercenaries and takes his place? And, and what takes you in as, like, oh, these... Fools, they were trying to steal something. No, then you just steal the case. Oh. I... Yeah, like, you can just do it. Like, we don't need to go get in there. That's crazy. Yeah, I don't really want to be stealing it either. And yeah, you, you seem, can just do you it. You're okay with that yeah, kind of like, stuff. Yeah, you can do it. I... All right, good luck. I... Good luck. I don't hmm. want to work and then with we all like that anymore. I'm gonna like encircle her and just like start clapping, like you know. That <laughs> Congratulations! 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 Wah, wah. <laughs> <laughs> and and before I do this, I get all of the 2,500 gold that he was going to pay us, right? Because he said 500 mm. each. So if what? I do this job on my own, what? then clearly I get all of the gold. Well, that's not true because Dad came up with the idea. What if we use right, your so plan instead? Fine. And he's and my you, dad, so... And you do bring us to him as prisoners. Say we were we sneaky, sneaky. And right. then... I Jetta, can see that I'm taking you to the, the program basement. is map tools. To, to throw oh. you in there. You want us to die? You don't even know what's <laughs> there. That's true. I mean, I think it's a pretty good idea. <laughs> like, oh, these, these the ruffians, they were... Uh, b being hooligans. Uh, well, uh, it kind of defeats the whole purpose of all of us if none of us get paid. That's, I think, what all of us are here for. So, uh, no, no offense. No, no, that's what I'm saying. That that it won't just be me doing this job alone. So, right. I will pretend to be one of their mercenaries and bring all of you into the mansion with me. And perception check. For me? Who? Everybody. Oh. <laughs> Something's happening. Something's happening. Hey. Hey, but your eyes are sharp. Hey. hey. We're all paranoid. Hey. Everyone. <laughs> all right. While you're uh, standing on the street, uh, quietly bickering amongst yourselves. Here comes a cart. Uh, these individuals <laughs> appear through the gate. Wait, is perception wisdom? No. Uh, that's, well, that's the base of perception. Oh. Oh, Okay. Okay. That's where you get your bonuses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Oh, these sketchy-ass looking dudes. Mm. And these individuals begin strolling up the street with purpose and direction. <gasps> oh! <laughs> I definitely thought you said erection. I also thought that. All right, the man up front <laughs> appears to be the leader, and the other two appear to be his guards. The first man <gasps> seems to be a handsome young uh, individual with Majitalian dress with an enormous scroll case on his back and he carries at his side a silvered cane. The man to his left appears to be a halfling warrior with an enormous mustache and a bravado kind of attitude. Mm -hmm. And the man on his right is a really gross-looking robed man. His name is Gross Derek. <laughs> the skinny pale God. wizard, big mustache, just... What? Oh, we're going over a plane. What are you talking That's about? them. That's them. Ooh, no, we, we, oh. we don't even have to go to the mansion. Oh. That's convenient shit. Oh. Hey, can I have that? Oh, oh, I'm going to walk oh, over here and oh, not boy. be associated with these people. <laughs> um, I'm also going to just sit here and... Can I... Hold there, sir! Okay. Look well, into um... my eyes, sir. Do I look like someone that you can simply accost? Hmm? Uh, be gone from uh, this pathway! What? Or oh, face <laughs> my needle. Gu guys, what is he saying? Oh, oh my. 
Guys. Go get your son. Go get your son. Son. <laughs> what, Dad? Oh. There's a time and place for everything, but My this apologies. is not it. I, I did oh. not realize your son was a simpleton. Many thousand <laughs> apologies, good Sarah. My I appreciate father. that you didn't initially, <laughs> as most do. Simple <laughs> lives lead to simple ends. His son like that. Oh, look, he thinks that. he's How people. <laughs> You've done a fine job of raising him, Sarah. I, I walk away with a small tear billowing up in the corner of my eye. <laughs> he will stroke his long, illustrious mustache. Mork isn't angry, but he just looks disgusted at what just happened. I... Sir, you really look like you could use a shave. Oh, no. What did that swine herder say to me? The hey, mustache hey, is bad. Shave. <laughs> hey. You could use a shave. Uh, whoa. Whoa, well, let's all... <coughs> oh. oh, that was wet. <laughs> all right, Carter, let's get you to the... To the, um... Where are we going? <sighs> are you guys going to the basement? <laughs> Oh no! I haven't been. I haven't been to the basement for a long time, man. I haven't been down there since Shorty drank that entire tankard of piss wine. <laughs> oh my! Oh, I had to clap for a week after that. <laughs> oh, that was a good story. We should we follow them? I like them. We should follow them. Okay. I don't think everybody should follow them. I think we should follow I'm them. I'm gonna follow them. Not all of them. Not I'm everyone. I'm going to run in the what way and doing? bump into the man. Not the, the orcs! Case. You're gonna bump into the man. This one? With the scroll case. Yeah. Not I'm, I'm gonna rush him running across the street. Oh, with the scroll oh, case? Oh, okay. Yes. Fuck. <laughs> oh my all god. Alright, you bump into him. Uh, as you do so, Sir Dimple will place his hand upon his uh, rapier and then will. <laughs> Hold, oh, sir! Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I just... Uh, you bathroom. shall not move! A... Bathroom, please. Oh, I gotta go. Please, you, please, 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 please. Oh, right? he just needs are, to go to the bathroom. Right? Let please, him go please, to the please. bathroom, saucy. No! I am not born yesteryear. This is gonna be on you real soon, please. Well, then that's a risk I'll take, random oh, stranger. Man, are you missing anything, Sarah? Oh, no, I... Uh, everything is here. Oh. Rock like a thief. Very uh. well. Well, I mean, yes, but please, defecate elsewhere. I'm going to uh, cast message on Neve and uh, just say, I hope that was an opportunity, and just keep running. <laughs> you can respond to message, right? Yeah, you yes, can. you can. I, come back and pee on him or something. <laughs> oh, God. oh, God, there's nothing over here. Oh, God, please, please. Anyone know where a bathroom is? You see what happening? Please. Does anyone know? All right, all right, all right. I'm gonna need a deception. I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need a deception. You ran past them, and now you're running back. I, I need a deception. Wow! Wow! Oh, he won't even know. Come on. Holy shit. <laughs> this keeps failing, so I'm gonna quietly while this is happening, I'm gonna sneak up here with my own plan. <laughs> oh my god. This is too much of a disaster. <laughs> no, it's not. John just rolled a fucking 20. This is perfect. This is the plan now. This Holy is the fuck. plan. I, I really just. <sighs> All right. <clears throat> Oh, he really needs a bathroom. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Here, let, you can just go in this alleyway. It's not a big deal. Let's come over here. Wait, can you show you me, please? Can you show me? Yes, yes, yes. Just, uh, just right. Right, 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 right. Please, please, please show me. Just right over there. There's a pond you could use. Wait. Oh, God. I can't even. Can you just please show me? Please, 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 please. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I'll move myself. Thank you very much. Oh, that's not me. <laughs> <It's all right. laughs> yeah, it's right over there. Wait, here. Wait, Come along, Sarah. Let's sit, make sure this homeless person is able to urinate for some reason. <laughs> 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 All right, there's a nice spot over here. To All this. right, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take a piss right here, I guess. <laughs> I feel oh, as if we've done a good thing. Deal. 
What a, what a terrible ordeal. Are, are you all all uh, right? Uh, while while uh, she's talking to him, I'm going to speak to Gross Derek. Why are you so gross? <laughs> Society, man. They put labels on shit, right? Oh, yeah. There's so much power in the fecal. Let me tell mm. you. God, you... I speak my language, brother. Amen. Sir, uh, you <laughs> are exposed out here on the street. I suggest we... Now hold on, Sir Saucy. We just helped a homeless man find a toilet. <laughs> <laughs> you should... You should never turn away the chance to do good deeds. You're right, of course, Sarah. That is why we are here, remember? Wait, so is he calling him Sarah like S-I-R-R-A-H? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> Mr. Stone, I'm terribly, terribly sorry about all of this. What an ordeal. I, I can't even imagine after you... How did you know my name? I... I... I was uh, I received a message that I am to be your escort uh, from the Mages Guild. Alright, that's a deception. <laughs> oh, fuck. As long as I don't roll a five again. Uh, uh, oh, plus eight. That's a lot of plus on that. That's pretty good. And and to ensure that your, your comfort during your stay here is seen to. An escort from the Mages Guild? But I told no one that I left. You know they have their ways. You can't go anywhere without them knowing. Wait, um, what kind of escort? I see. Let's just say that the right people have your back on this. Oh. Well. Well, okay then. Uh, <clears throat> very well. Uh, what is your name? I am Chris Treneva. Chris Treneva. I, 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 apologies, I have not heard the name. Which, what school do you belong to? Oh, what school? I don't know what school is there. Is, is this like the origins? <laughs> or... Time to test that knowledge. Give me uh -oh. some arcana. Well, having, <laughs> having been raised there, see, I don't know what I would know from just having been raised in Majital for a while. Well, you still have to roll an arcana, but I'm going to make the DC lower because you're from there. Okay. Holy shit! What is wow, dude! That? that is tragic. Okay, Ooh. but that doesn't mean you're completely devoid of knowledge. You are from there. However, I cannot tell you what the right answer is. You think that he is referring to one of the schools, which in this case are one of the schools of magic. I can tell you what the schools of magic are because you would know them, but I cannot mm. tell you which one you think is the right answer. So you're going That's to have fair. to make a decision. All right? I'll well, give I'm, you... I'm... Mm, okay. Let me give you the list here. What medical school school did you go to? Dentistry? <laughs> Den -den <laughs> Den Dentistry? This would be a really good middle school program. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Oh, don't, don't man. Take out your friend's baby teeth, guys. Ugh. All right. Let me type these up for you. I'd, <laughs> I'd name them, but there are a lot of them, so it's just going to be better. A lot of them? So she's just going <laughs> to... Make illusion. That'll this make you sound just... okay. Or, well, I don't even know if he's referring to these kinds of schools of magic. He is. Or, yeah, right. Yeah. This ought to be good, Naomi. I, I'd, I'd like to think that like when we pause like this... Everybody's mouth is contorted or weird, and it's like when you pause a movie and they're making funny faces. Mine's oh, yeah. always scrunchy. All right. It's one of them. Ah. Remember <laughs> who you're talking to. He might try to, like, grill you. I'm an arcane student raised by the guild, sent out on various missions across the world. I don't spend a lot of time in Maj at all, but I do get letter correspondence from the guild. I see. Are you a nomad, then? Of a sort. Thanks again, gentlemen. <laughs> yeah, I mean, she, I never. Sarah, really I, I really that must that protest. We had no, we had no word that there would be an escort from your home country. You're in Dalton. It's a dangerous place. Of course, they would want their kind to be seen to. Sarah, I, I really must protest. I, I advise against this. 
Sir Dimple, do you know anything about magic? My name is Sir Dimple Saucy! <laughs> <clears throat> Sir Dimple Saucy, do you know anything about magic? Or are you just very capable of that rapier of yours? I am a scholar of sorts. I cannot cast, but I know of it. I know how to oh. kill mages. You know of it. Well, then I suggest that you leave the magic dealings to the mages. Oh. <laughs> he will... Oh, fun. <laughs> See how you feel when I put a hole in your lovely throat. Oh, no. But then he will whisper that to himself and say, Surat is your choice, of course, but I really must protest. Oh, hey, look, man. Um, I'm just here to ensure your comfort is seen to. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she seems nice. She's got purple hair. <coughs> no, 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 no. I have, I have a brown uh, hair. Brown hair. Excuse me. I see, I'm very drunk. <laughs> Me too, brother Yar. <laughs> Me too, brother. Me I too am. Brother I am toasted, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very well then. Uh, in that case, please come with us, and I will explain mm. why we are here. Right. Um, I'm so very sorry about my simpleton friends earlier, but uh, they are also. Wait, you know me. these people? Uh, not not the one that was pitting in the corner, no, I think that was just a random hobo, but uh, these two greenskins, unfortunately. Are we going to- Oh, what more do? I see. And you will all be escorting us? They don't need to know the ins and outs. They're just here for extra protection from, well... The unsavory types on the streets. See, they look like the unsavory types as well, but that sim signifies to the other unsavory hey. types that they need to stay away. It's all right, boss. Believe me. <laughs> this place sucks. <laughs> hey, um... Isn't this your hometown? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, um, I see. You want, if you want, you could ride on my dad's shoulders. He's got big, big, big ones. Oh, yes, uh, he does provide uh, mm, rides. He's an Uber. Yeah, he's, he's, he's uber big. <laughs> well, then, let's continue. <laughs> Come along, Arg. Okay, I'll move you guys together. <laughs> <laughs> Can I, can I, can I sit, sit, stand beside Dad? <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Hold on to my thingy. I will. I'll hold on to, like, your pinky with, like, my one, my actual hand. It's as big as a sausage. Yeah, right? I'm gonna slowly and quietly follow behind very far. Wait, where, uh -huh. did, where did John <laughs> Yeah, where did yeah. you go, John? I'm doing my own thing. Don't worry about it. John! Rativa's, Rativa's being a homeless man. I need you, John. We have to sneak. John! <laughs> I, I, I look back. Do I do I see Arx Loras following? Uh, yes. Oh, there you are. Get get back here. I was looking for you. Ah! <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know if she wants me she there or not. I, 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 I point. I was... I point. Oh, Come okay. Come here now. Uh, your pay will be docked for the next week. What? Is this, <laughs> is this a friend of yours? Oh, shit. <sighs> you see, unfortunately, everybody they give to help me are the simpletons. I have to train them and try to make them actually obedient and, you know, smarter and everything. But, oh, God, mm. it's such a nightmare. Sounds like the I've been looking for this one for a while. Apparently, she's just been creeping behind. Oh, fuck. Part of the story, or is she really mad at us? What an what an asshole! Oh, I have to I have to pretend I'm an idiot I, now. I I I, I wink. 
Arr, arr, I, I, I'm sorry. I, arr, arr. Arr. Does she have dust in her eyes? Can I read my <laughs> mother's thoughts? Who's <laughs> in my head? I wonder what he's thinking about. If you could read Mork's mind, it's just a, he's imagining himself eating bread. <laughs> I really appreciate chat right now. This is starting to look suspiciously like a party of adventurers. <laughs> okay, Sir Saucy is not having it. A fourth person? No. We call that a, we call that a fucking squad. <laughs> All right, then. Sarah, I really must protest. Now there's a fourth one. <laughs> <laughs> well, didn't you know that it's a lucky seven? <laughs> You're here under the protection of Seco Cuse. Pardon me, Greenskin. He, he will look down at Mad Mork. <laughs> How long have you been traveling with this individual? Uh... Mork holds up two fingies. <laughs> two days so far. I see. He will look and decide not to ask you a question. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even get anything. How come he gets Sussy. off easy? <laughs> Sir, Sir Dimple Saucy, are you not aware that seven is a number of luck? Seven is the number when split in two means one side is outnumbered. Well, good thing we're not splitting into two then, isn't it? I do not know you, female. Therefore, Sorry. I do not trust you. Are you not strong and skilled enough with that rapier to take two of us if you needed to? Or maybe even three? You look very strong. But he's so You're tiny. I said what? Dad split a guy in two one time. What did you say? I you said you're, you're kind of short. That's because you are freaking. I old. am three foot eight. That's I am an enormous one. halfling. Is that big for halflings? That might be. That yes. Big for a halfling. I am tall and my genitals are long. <laughs> That's great. Oh. But That's I'm gonna scary. have to ask you to prove that. No. <laughs> I'll show you yours if you'll show me mine. <laughs> Make him show Wait, you what? his. <laughs> what did you just? <laughs> I'll show you yours. <laughs> I'm gonna rip it from your bed. <laughs> you uh... <laughs> I love Hobgobbo talk. Just like work. <laughs> Sarah, I really must protect. <laughs> <laughs> Turkey just starts pulling out his dick. And no! <laughs> Can I roll for length? No. No, I'm not doing that again. How many <laughs> centimeters? <laughs> oh, wait, okay. Tell me about the first time. Fuck this shit. That I'm out. A, I left. A, that was the furry D&D &D group. That was a very it? long... An exhausting story. <laughs> Maybe at the end of the session. Okay. Protesting intensifies. <laughs> the party continues. I'm just gonna <laughs> abandon that conversation. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait. It's just banter anyway, it's fine. It's just banter. It's, it's just a little light bantering. Alright. Okay, where wait, where are you really, Jun? Because I gotta transfer maps. <laughs> oh. I thought we were uh, going towards the house on the, uh, or not the house. The oh, oh we, we are, but it's oh, just. Oh, there you are. It's, it's yeah. going to be like this. Yeah, that's, I was conveniently uh, waiting here. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Fancy. Hey, look, it's the piss mage. Oh, oh. No, oh hi. Yeah. She's touching me. Sir. Hey, hey, guys. Uh, I just, you can see, uh, there's, I, I, earlier I put some water on the bottom of my robe. I, I need a new robe. <laughs> uh, oh. Ah, yes. Come to the head tailor himself to get a new robe. Good plan. Oh, that was the idea. I heard he was the best. Maybe he's not a hobo after all. Mm. Just, just... Sarah, I really must protest. This man is not <laughs> homeless. <laughs> I never said I was homeless. Wait, why? Excuse me. Why did you say I was homeless? 
Do only homeless people have to use the bathroom? <laughs> I believe only homeless people in ragged robes run past individuals screaming for a bathroom before urinating in the street. <laughs> like you've never had an emergency. I don't believe that at all. I mean, I've pissed in the street before and I have a home. Yes, but you're gross, Derek! <laughs> I pee in the street all the time. Well, maybe that's right, yeah, it's true, yeah. <laughs> Well, I feel a little gross right now myself, so... Oh, it's all right, fella. Comes up, slaps you on the back. Yeah. Here, have oh. some of my swamp drink. It'll give you a flask. <laughs> oh. I'm going to put it to my mouth and, like, take a sip and not actually swallow anything and go... Mm. Just putting it up to your mouth, you taste it. It's bad. <laughs> it's <All> really right. <laughs> bad. Oh, you like my swamp ski? That's what I call it. Mm. <laughs> it's like whiskey, but it's made out of... Decrepit water. I mean, mm -hmm. the real good stagnant mm -hmm. stuff. Like mosquito eggs are in it. I'm just gonna oh. go in the building. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm gonna transfer the map now. <laughs> Thanks. I hate it. I don't. Okay. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> everybody, everybody, good. Everybody yep. feeling yeah. good? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. That's good. Good. Okay. Couple of things. Okay. Uh, as you enter the foyer of this manor, you may have instantly regretted it. Oh. Is it oh, filled with my phobias? Actually, I was going to ask about that. Oh, boy. Does anybody here have phobias that I need to be aware of? Uh, Mork fears no creature or man. I'm talking <laughs> players. Oh. 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 None for me, thanks. Open water. Flying. Okay. Well, we're in an airplane. Sorry, Scott. <laughs> Not that I wish to, uh, you know, reveal anything, but uh, does anybody here have a fear of if it's spiders, it, I'm out of here. Does anybody have arachnophobia? Mm, and does no. anybody have coralophobia? What's that? Fear clowns, clowns, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, <laughs> we hang out with Russ. I I'm <laughs> just <laughs> asking. Who's scared of me? Because I'm just asking. Okay. I have a clown tattoo, so no. <laughs> okay, good. Because I actually had somebody lose their shit before when I introduced <laughs> clowns, and they uh, left the game for good. Oh Jeez. no! <laughs> yeah, it was it was pretty bad. So mm -hmm. that's the perfect way to face your fears through D and D. That's true. Go murder hobos on some clown. Hong Kong. <laughs> yeah, giant clown spiders. I can't answer that. <laughs> All right, let me know when you're loaded. As I get some new music here. Yeah, I bet you'd like us to let you know when we're loaded. I'm loaded. I'm not. I am loaded. <gasps> Yay! Ah, a massive spider statue. Ah, uh, I see. A man of class and tasteful interior. Oh, is that a statue elegance? Oh, shit. <laughs> What's on their food table? Ooh, a spider. I, I... I don't understand what kind of family this is that everybody has a plate of different food on the table. That just, that never happens. They all cook for themselves. And they somehow have, like, enough kitchen space to all cook? Hell yeah. Maybe they have, like, four kitchens. That's insane. I mean, it's a mansion, so isn't it... Four, mm -hmm. four kitchens wouldn't be a surprise. That's true. This is short, so I'm gonna set it to loop. All right. Oh, yeah, me too. As you enter the manor, there is a uh, palpable tension that is just hanging over the air. Everyone notices it, and the bickering that was held before seems to drift away. Um, you notice that the two mercenaries finally begin to act like professionals and step up ahead in front of Carter. Sir Dimple's hands are on both his rapiers, ready to strike at a moment's notice. And Gross Derek summons his rat swarm familiar as his entire cloak is filled 
with his red-eyed brethren. Carter will also look nervous, as if he did not expect what is happening. And then, a mysterious figure will appear at the top of this staircase and will begin to walk down it. A very obese-looking individual with fancy clothing and gaunt, hollow eyes will appear before you. He carries in his right hand an ornate staff, which he uses as a walking stick. In his left hand, he holds what appears to be a very small, one of those decorative dogs, except the dog is obviously deceased. And he will approach... Greetings, Carter. I have been waiting for you. Uh, Carter uh, will look really uncomfortable, and then he will say, Are you Lord Firth? Yes, Lord Firth is my name. Do you have... What I seek. Well, sir, I have the first of many clues, but as I said in my letters, what you are seeking is not, well, not entirely possible. This is all just conjecture. My dear boy, every expedition begins with a bold first step. I suppose that's true. And then the um, individual will begin to move uh, the large scroll case off of his back. And then he will then bring it forward. No, no, no. Not here, my lad. Not here. Follow me. We must away to somewhere more private. As he's just looking at the case, because, you know, he totally forgot the mission. <laughs> All right. And Lord Foley will begin to move in this direction. Carter will move, and then Sir Dimple will put his hand on his chest. Sirrah, I truly must protest. This man has evil written all across his consonants. He does. I have no guarantee that we can protect you. Well, I must. This is what I must do. Sir Dimple Saucy, weren't you just saying something about the danger of numbers? Well, it seems we have those. Enough from you! Now is not the time for our quibbles. There's a far greater threat before us. Are you sure, Sirrah? I must, Sir Saucy. If you wish to... If you wish to be no longer in my employ, I understand. Sirrah, I signed my word of honor to that parchment. I shall be with you until my dying breath. Yeah, I'm, I'm good too, I guess. It's so romantic. Oh man, I am toasted. Alright, what did the rest of you guys do? I I'm going with him. Uh. I'm going to continue to act clueless like I'm just looking for a robe. I'm gonna follow them, like, because, like... I mean, we're all a squad, except his, his for Jun, so we all have to follow, don't we? He just thinks he needs well, to get it. Well, the weird so thing is, is that the man didn't even seem to register the rest of you guys being there. And as oh. you are standing within the manor, you notice that it is... Well, decrepit. There are cobwebs, there's dust. Like, if this man has servants... They have either abandoned him or he fired them. The place is in disrepair, but the probably the most alarming bit is that there, there seems to be handprints on the walls in the dust and footsteps in the dust, but completely undisturbed otherwise. This place has seen some shit. 
Can I, um... Can I kind of, like, sense if anything is off about this, like, uh, in terms of, you know, like, uh, arcane? Like, is is anything, like, off about this place? Uh, Detect magic. I don't have that. <laughs> such, such a check would require a religion check. Religion. Ooh. Uh, I mean, sure, I'll go for it, but... I don't know much about that. 14 reveals to you that there are there are such things as spirits, phantoms, and haunts. You don't know how these marks or tracks could have been placed otherwise. But what is perhaps the most telling sign is that you start to see some strange symbology. As you begin to look around, you notice that what, what, what once appeared to be mundane objects, when viewed from certain angles, produce symbols. Symbols of an arcane origin. This stack of books here, it's stacked in such a way that if stood here, they produce a symbol of fear. Everything in the room seems to be strangely arranged in such a way, and like some sort of mad scramble like you are inside of the journal of a madman mm. but what is perhaps the most concerning is that you can sense that there is just the slightest twinge of magic and it echoes everywhere it's light but it's there like a sickness over the house Mm. Uh, hey, guys. Yeah? Uh, there's boy. This place seemed kind of... Hang on. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Hang on. And I'm gonna, like, slap my face, and then while I'm doing that, I'm gonna cast, uh, Divine Sense. <laughs> okay. Oh. He needs oh, the pain. Yeah, he, he needs, needs to it. pain it. <laughs> All right. Do I do I get any hotness? Like, how do I even do that? I forget. Uh, you just do it, and I handle oh, the rest. Okay. okay, cool. All right, listen, Cry. What up, dog? <clears throat> when you use detect, you sense a great evil has etched itself within the floorboards, Ooh. within the very house itself. And here, you hear these words echo in your mind. Streets of gold. Terror unfold. Light and red and black and gray. Never then shall I stay. That's it. Guys. Ma, this place is freaking evil. Oh, well, I, just, I mean, what tipped I, you off? The dead uh, fucking dog? Well, I mean, like, I did, like, my... Because, like, you see my shield, you know, I'm I'm part of, like, you know, that, that cult of, like, happy people. But, like, dude, there's, like, there's bad stuff here, guys. Like, I just mm -hmm. had a voice in my head. It was freaking wild. We need that scroll case. Yeah, but, like, I'm telling you, it's like, uh... What if we just, uh, what if we just stormed them as they were walking away? You're going downstairs. Oh. Mm -hmm. I think right this is smash! I'm gonna just, like, smash this with, like, uh... Oh, like, stop. Just to see what happens with my, my I think, my or, I think you, you two should just go with her. Just to purge the demon. Purge the demon gonna... from right Ugh. here, this little bookshelf. All right, you smash the bookshelf and it falls apart with ease. Neglect and <clears throat> time have taken their toll. It falls apart easily. What an old bookcase. However. Yeah? Whoa! 
MOTHERFUCKERS! <laughs> the shadows seem to lengthen. You hear a whisper of a strange language that you do not translate. And then, as quickly as it appeared, the shadows dissipate once more. I didn't tell you guys. Right. I freaking tell you guys this place is evil. Uh, yeah, we know. Our the thing is getting away. What are we supposed to do? We I must get know. this case. Get the more get case. Told us to not go in the basement though. We're all going for the goddess. Rivet, Rivet, you and I. Gosh, you and I will stay here and we will yeah, look I'm, around. I'm okay with that. Well, let's stay because. I can protect you, but we need to stay up here. The three of them, they can go down and follow. Send don't a even know I'm He's just going to gonna run guys. up and start smashing the face of the statue with a No, sir! Oh my God. Idiot! Good. Everyone freeze. I gotta purge the evil. Everyone freeze. Oh. Oh my God, is this actually alive? Uh, is this thing actually alive? Right, look at what you did. Whew, I'm glad I'm out of that AOE. <laughs> Holy shit, what is happening? Yeah, good luck. Take two steps back quick. <laughs> the majority of my portrait's not in there. I'm good. <laughs> oh no! Cry. It I was think we a lost statue. cry. I Yo, did you cry. know if you topple over altars, you get cursed? Come on, bro. All right. As you smash down on the spider statue, uh, it will shatter easily. However, the reason that it is so weak is not just from neglect, but because. It is actually filled with thousands of spiders. Oh my god. Oh, oh yes, those aren't <laughs> shadows. The, uh, oh. the spiders spray out in all directions in a mad swarming scramble. And there is only one character that is caught within them. So therefore, that character will take all of the effect. Oh. Cry. Oh, you just destroyed the obelisk, dude. You're not supposed to touch the obelisk. Turkey. I need you yeah. to make me five constitution saving throws. Oh, God. Oh, 1,000 yeah. saving throws. <laughs> Here we go. Look what you've done. Look at what you've done. My boy, no! <laughs> Unfortunate. Ugh. You got four more. Wait, I'm trying, I'm trying. Oh, I gotta click it each time, okay. Oh. Oh. I'm about to become morning more. What are you oh. doing? <laughs> oh no! Oh, no. Oh, my God, I don't want to That's really bad. Sorry. You shouldn't have done that. Why did you think this was They're a They're going to crawl into your skin, I, I don't want to metagame. Oh, this is what he would do. I got a 20 oh. on one of them. <laughs> This is the one cancel out the 20. I don't know I don't how that works, so. but I mean, that, I think that makes it all me feel adds good up. at least. It makes me feel better about it, things at least. I so, think I mean, it's going to all add up, I'll, buddy. I'll, I'll die like a, a champion, at least, in my brain. Where's uh, Toral? I love him. I need him. Oh, God. Pray to him. <laughs> Where's right. Toral? Like, it feels oh, like a sanity check kind of thing, too. If all you right. Ask me. Uh, the spiders swarm all over you. You are covered in hundreds of bites. Uh, some of them even begin to attempt to embed themselves into your skin oh in a God. mad Ugh. scramble. The spiders surround and just begin to tear you to pieces. Uh, cover your eyes! You take 44 <laughs> points eyes. of poison damage. Holy oh, shit. shit! Well, later, dude. You fall to the ground. <clears throat> the intense pain and venom begins to course through your body. You will die within seconds unless your party is able to save you. However, anyone that wishes to attempt to save Turkey will have to enter the swarm of spiders. Oh my god. So, do I have any volunteers? How do we um, save him? Uh, this is just a snippet of what's going on in this this massive thing. <laughs> just so you know. All right, this is how you can save him. You can either heal him, which will bring him back from death's door. You can... Uh, attempt to cure the poison through more mundane means with a healer's kit or other such magic. Uh-oh. Hello? Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Hello? Oh, no. Oh, no. What happened? We oh, lost our so bad. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. The spiders got our Kato. Oh, shit. Rest in peace, our fucking DM. <laughs> Hello? Am I back? Hello? Hello? Yeah. You're good. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, so here are your options. Uh, any sort of healing can bring... Um, 
can bring Turkey back from the brink. Uh, if you're mm -hmm. able to cure the poison that is sifting through him, like if you have any special ability with that. Or you can attempt to appease the spiders. As now I get to explain to you a little something called the creeping death. <laughs> it's right there. I see it. You don't got to explain it. <laughs> I comprehend is bad. So uh, the creeping, the creeping uh. death is actually the name of a continental sized spider swarm that lives in the forests of Dalton. Uh, it is a spider swarm that is two miles in diameter, approximately. <gasps> now, oh. it is believed that both, it's both a myth kind of, but also kind of true, that all spiders in Dalton are a part of the swarm. Now, oh. now that may not be entirely accurate. It is accurate enough that most people just assume that it's fact. So people in Dalton do not fuck with spiders. They don't kill them. They do their best to not piss them off. Oh. Which is why the spiders. You know, that's were a good primer we should have had. Why the spiders are well, you're not from Dalton. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and that's why the spiders are kept in the spider statue. Oh. Uh, so. so I just attacked the uh, creeping death entirety you, of it. You kicked the hive, dude. Yeah, you kicked now, the hive, and now they're mad. So they're... you can attempt to appease the spiders if any of you can roll uh, proper knowledge checks to do so. Or you can attempt to attack the spiders. But I will also, tell just, you that hmm. if Turkey is either A, not healed, or B, the spiders are not appeased or destroyed within three rounds, he will die. Three just, rounds? Three really rounds? Quick, does lay of hands help me in this at all, or am I it, just kind of... It, it would if you were conscious. Okay, got you. So, so anybody got one of them health pots? So three rounds as in we all take a turn, right? Three and then times. It's... Three turns for all of us, yes. I, I, just yeah. making sure. So, who has the most knowledge here? Also, Naomi what? Probably. What? Uh, I would also right? love to know your your actual character reactions to this too. Before we go right into combat and reactions of this. Okay. Well, I, I would love Mort to know. What was about to head downstairs, and then he turns around, hearing, <laughs> <laughs> and now he's um, just shocked. My reaction is. <laughs> yeah, door. I don't know you. Valid, I'm dude. out. <laughs> that's valid. <laughs> he draws the line. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I draw the line at spiders. See you guys. Yara, uh, that's a that's a nasty looking fuck. Uh, I, I turn nice. around and I I turn pale and my eyes grow wide and it's like like white like sheet white pale and my eyes are just like dinner like apple size basically <laughs> and I'm, just... <laughs> I'm a sea dog man i've seen i've seen giant fucking sea creatures so this is nothing <laughs> i mean it's not good mm. but you know <laughs> no he, yeah but i'm not gonna i'm not running out the fucking door <laughs> like i mean <laughs> this reminds me of that time that fucking kraken ate my boy jimmy gems Pretty much. <laughs> Do I know anything about See you later, Turkey! <laughs> what was your question? I had a good run. Do I know anything about the spider swarm? Uh, I don't think any of the characters here are actually from Dalton. <laughs> nope. So you won't know anything this. inherently. Uh, but you can make a history check to learn mm -hmm. more about the creeping death. Oh, I am not man. a smart man. I am genuinely, as a player, okay if this is how Turkey dies. I'm not going to be upset at all, by the way. Well, <laughs> let's try and not let that happen, all right? Yeah, cool. I mean, I can come back with another character. That's a D&D &D game. I don't... <laughs> with a history We're going to of... try our best here. <laughs> the they... worst character of all time. <laughs> <laughs> the... <laughs> I know, die session you. You want him to die? Like you no, I'm so playing much. him You don't want him is. to die, he's just playing him as he would. As he plays we gotta every deal fucking with this bullshit make. evil. I'm also going to sit here and ponder because I've heard stories as a, as a salty sea dog. And I've heard all types of stories, so I'm going to see if I know anything. I, I might have read about this in a book. Oh. Oh. All right. Hey, look at that. This, look, at, look at what we know. <laughs> this is what you know. The spiders of Dalton are believed to be led by one central hive mind. And that hive mind belongs to a spider that is simply referred to as the White Widow. Now, it is believed that this spider at the heart um, is actually a, a sort of pseudo deitic entity. Although, that's not entirely accurate. It is believed by scholars that 
the Creeping Death is one of the Epitim, which are the representations of primal forces on Kalkatesh, and that it is the incarnation of hunger. So therefore, the best way to appease the Creeping Death, to keep it from consuming turkey, is to give it something else to eat. Turkey. I, <laughs> I reach into my pocket and take out my apple slice. Oh, shit. And put it at the edge of the pile of spiders. It disappears instantly. It's not enough. Uh, I mean, while I'm outside, I'm running. Are there any, like, guards out here? Or any uh, yeah. patrolmen? Yeah, there's some. I'm just going to start frantically screaming. The, the... Oh, spiders. Jesus, there's a man being eaten alive by spiders in here. Please, someone help. They look at each other. They nod. That oh, sounds they right. Oh, <laughs> they know. They know. They know. They don't <laughs> care. They know and they don't yep. care. Uh, where Where is it, sir? Oh, and then I point to, you know. Right here, all right, all right, and they start. They nod. They uh, they start ringing a bell, and a bunch of guardsmen begin to cordon off the the mansion. Oh, oh. oh. Well, <laughs> you guys are great companions. <laughs> Keep the spider uh, contained. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. yeah that's, that's the, they're not gonna go in and kill it. They're just gonna yeah, exactly. keep them in there. <laughs> that's what they're mm -hmm. gonna do. That's honestly very very smart. Yar, wait. Yara, what about that large fellow? Who, me? All right, it looks no, like, the other Yara. It looks, the like, other large it looks like there's only nine available actions on the table, so one's you, so you've got eight left. Uh, oh, shit. Okay, like wait, no. wait. So are, are, are all of these doors closed? Uh, Most of them, yeah. Mm, there might be kitchens in this mansion. Anything where we can get some food. I just like the context of the way you said that. Like, man, I'm hungry. Let's get some food, man. <laughs> Let's go eat. I'm like bummed out. <laughs> I'd like to know if I could take one turn and probably use my like action surge to run in, grab turkey, and then run out of this swarm. You sure can. Uh, whatever the punishment may be while I take it while doing so. You may do that. All right. Well, I guess that's what I'll make do. Me, I'll run in. Make me four constitution saving oh. throws. All right. Oh, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. My subconscious oh, is just, no. like, imagining oh, no. being held in, like, an angelic father figure. His arms. Okay. Cry, you did this to your father. The oh, newspaper God. morning. Six people were murdered by spiders yesterday. Party <laughs> <laughs> Oh. They were all in a pile no. together. Oh, oh no! no. no. Yeah, that's like my seventh one in this campaign. Turkey no! Oh, it was such a good family. Unfortunate. Oh my god. <laughs> was that twirl just popping up from the corner? It was terrifying. No, that was just me. Unfortunate. Okay. I wish Toral was here. Arr, arr, maybe he <laughs> arr, arr, arr. <laughs> All right. Hopefully, I'll roll low. Thirty-two. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I Thirty-two. You, I would have. You charge through the spider swarm. So. All right, Jesus you, you fall atop you fall atop the body of Turkey in a protective embrace uh, as the spiders tear your skin uh, from your body. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, this is hilarious. Uh, so I'm reduced to like one hit point because of relentless dirt and dirt. Ah, yes, somewhere. that's true. You would like to use that? Uh, yeah, definitely. Okay. <laughs> All right, you get one more action. All right. Uh, have I grabbed him with my you action got him. surge? You got him. Then I'd like to run the fuck out. <laughs> All right. You run out of the cloud of spiders uh, right in front of Neve, covered in wounds, sucking, oh pussing God. wounds Ugh. as spiders crawl out of your skin and you oh. collapse with turkey in your hands. Oh, oh my God. God. This sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is that one HP that's like permanent or or? No, 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 no. He's 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 he got an action, but he's down. You guys, oh. you still have to save them. Yeah. But oh. now that they're out of the swarm, they don't automatically fail their death saving throws. So I need you both to make me a death saving throw, which should be on your token. Is all right. So really quick, mm -hmm. uh, are we still covered in spiders, or are they? You still not? got a lot of them, but you're not in the swarm anymore. 
Okay, so they 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 just kind of like we can right. brush them off of you. I, I will tell you, it is like if you get a. All right. You are not in an optimal amount of spider coverage, like, but you see what I mean. You have them on you, but they're not like consuming That's you. That's fair. That's yeah. fair. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we so, both. Um. That's all right. We're still living. Okay. All right. You got two more chances. Right. Knowing, knowing that Turkey can heal, I I give my healing potions to him. All right, you put the healing potion in Turkey's mouth. Blah, 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 blah. Wait, how does he, how does that work? Do I like immediately it's a roll. wake up from that kind of stuff? Or? Yep, you immediately oh. go from zero to not dead. Seven health? Oh. oh. Well, you, you can't, Whoa. you don't go into negatives in fifth edition. What the, f what happened? Dad! And I cast Lay on Hands on Dead. Okay. Would you like to use all ten? Yes. Okay. Needle's good, man. <laughs> <laughs> having no more, having no more meat, the spiders will then scurry back into the spider. Oh, oh, okay. So, so uh, like that. Don't. God. Don't oh. do that again. Oh. I'm gonna I'm gonna go outside to I'm gonna poke my head out and start yelling. Alright, what you yelling? Hey! River! Matey! Get your ass back in here! The spiders are gone! Arr. And then I go back in. <laughs> you sound like a Jenna Marbles was a pirate. Good. <laughs> Dad, you saved me. All in a day's work. <coughs> I'll, I'll never forget this. I'll Please never you... touch another statue, ever. <laughs> I swear. And then, I, can I have a, a fear of statues from now on, like a, a sure. flaw? All right. <laughs> cool, cool. Thank you. All right, Just I'm gonna, I'm gonna start unbarring the, the door. Yes, absolutely. All right, as, as you uh, make your way inside, the guards let you in. That's fine. They're just making sure <laughs> nobody gets out. Great guards. <laughs> Look, man. <laughs> what the... the hell happened? Apparently, there was a lot of spiders in the Why big one. Why did you hit it? It's evil. Look at it. And I it's point at the statue. spider statue. It's I mean... a green skin thing. You wouldn't understand. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't understand. <laughs> Wait, during all of this, did nobody come up from the basement? Oh yeah. Mm -mm. Um, no. I. What? How long was that? That's a that? little concerning. If this going on wasn't enough of a concern for them to actually come up here, what's going on down there then? Maybe we should just abandon this then, job. Is it worth it? I just imagine if this was a movie, it would just cut to a frame of just what's happening in the basement. Now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we like could always come back, ladies. <laughs> Meanwhile, back in the basement. <laughs> Everyone's dead. Oh gosh. The yeah. ritual is complete. <clears throat> Sarah, I really must protest. <laughs> there you go. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Phew, there's no Balrog down there, so we're all right. That's good. That's good. Look, all right. <sighs> Do you guys think this is worth it anymore? Yes! The lady demands You're it! You're literally covered in pus and death, are you sure? <laughs> Goals come with sacrifice. If Dad says It was not our time to die. He's right. He must continue. He, he must continue and I will follow him. Uh, what's the down arrow on them? That means they are prone because they were unconscious. Oh, okay. I can clear it though. We're we're still rolling on the round. <laughs> we're just rolling. On the <laughs> just prone crawling everywhere. Mm -hmm. This is a sneaking mission. <laughs> this is how we don't get spotted by the spiders. Uh, you guys can go down there if you want. I'm I'm gonna be the last one going down those stairs though. <laughs> to help you guys remember, I marked the statue with holy shit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, fair enough. <laughs> All right, so I actually forgot where the hell the stairs actually were. Is it like, They're right next to oh, right. right. them. 
no. Uh, do we, we have to sneaking? like make kind of like a, a roll because we're like crawling down the stairs? I'm not crawling. <laughs> oh. I'm not prone. I definitely am. I'm sitting at the top of the stairs. <laughs> okay. What about you, yeah. Ross? I might as well just do the same just to protect our little cowardly friend here. Make sure that you wouldn't run from a thousand spiders. Get out of here. Arr, I didn't. A thousand? That was way more than a thousand. Yar, I stayed here and watched. That, that's the kinky thing. Are, are we sneaking? <laughs> this or... I'm All sneaking. right. All right. Uh, so a couple of things. Look at this fucking place. Ooh. All right. All right. Uh, as you get down to the bottom of the stairs, you can see old blood stains seem to stain the rather fanciful marble and that cobwebs and skeleton cobweb and co oh god cobwebs and bones align atop this bookshelf here it seems however that they seem to form a sort of curious symbol i don't know if you guys can see that yeah I see. Mm -hmm. and you see that lord foley furs is speaking with carter softly while the other two mercenaries are are not they just don't like him at all And as you get to the bottom of the stairs, you overhear this. Sir, I I don't think I should give this to you. Now is not the time to grow a conscience, Carter. We are on the brink of something magnificent. Don't give it to him. Carter will look up and see the other three enter. Hey. Don't. Uh, this guy probably does evil stuff. He's got spiders. Sarah, I must not protest their claims. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Dad! And then I point at Dad, and he's like gross as fuck looking right now. Oh. Like we should not do this. Poison. Look, he would unleash this flag on, on the entire world. This place will consume you. Is it you that command your mercenaries? Or your mercenaries to command you, Carter. Well, sir, can you at least explain to me what it is you will use the scroll for? There have been too many signs that perhaps there is nefarious purpose here. Very well, I will explain. But it is better to show you. All right, and then he will pull one of the books on the bookshelf and oh boy, here we go. Sorry, very happy. Commence the sacrifice. It was, this, the hat. it was leading up to this moment. <gasps> Wait, like Michael Myers cat in the hat? Because I'm out of here if that's the case. <laughs> Look at that hidden room. That's so sick. Oh, oh, is that but a, also, that's is that like a D30? <laughs> <laughs> like a... Whoa. Another evil room. <laughs> Poor rat. All right. And he will pull back on the bookshelves and... <laughs> Track's a little loose. <laughs> Does anybody follow inside? Hell yeah. As everyone what kind of man a has a secret laboratory? How can you trust this man? An evil man. Can I hit him? No more hitting yet. Yes. Emphasis on yet. Yet. Carter will then enter. The others will file in as well. What is this place, Lord Furs? This, my dear boy, is where we will right the wrongs of the past. Where that which was broken shall be remade. What do you mean? Have you not noticed, boy? There is a sickness. A sickness in the air. Our city bleeds, and pungent filth fills the void of its lifeblood. A palopy of gold and lantern lead the blind 
Oh, is this the Streets of Gold thing? Carter, the scroll that you have is the final piece. But what do you... What do you mean? It is just a scroll. My dear boy, it is more than just a scroll. It is a piece of the nine. The nine gifts of the sage of the past. It is the Eldar's blood. The scroll is more than you could imagine. It is a scroll that forged a god. What? I don't think this Foley even sees us or hears us. What? He... I don't think he's really here. And upon that... What? And upon that mention, you will notice, Neve, that he is blind. Whoa. Whoa. Dude, fucking whoa, plot twist. For all he knows, it's one guy's with many voices. Carter. <laughs> Carter. Give the scroll to me. I, I kind of take Carter by the arm and try to, like, step one step away with him. He he doesn't move. He he seems unsure. Sarah, I really must protest. Do not do this thing. Do not trust this man. All right, stop. I don't know what he's going to oh. do. Oh. You fool! Uh oh, I was just oh, trying you to. You stepped like... inside the circle. Oh, he was just trying to join the I conversation. I saved you for too. nothing. He was just trying to join oh the conversation. God. This is totally just what would happen. He just casually just joined the conversation of being like, "Yo, it's evil." But all right, well, hey, that's how he do. That's Turkey, man. I'm sorry. Oh God! I swear to God, I was not trying to do anything. I swear. Say goodbye to your blood, dude. We need to go over uh, by that noise. This does not sound good. Can I, can I? Am I allowed to step out of it? Yeah. Uh, that was weird. Uh, I more insistently pull on Carter's arm and like try to yank him he, over he, this way. He, he he resists, and will say, I, "Why? You have not explained why you need it." Do you not see the evil? Yep, yep, yep. That's we need freaking to get out evil. Of here, I'm just gonna casually start like wag, just, well, like wagging my like whip at the like, the <laughs> evil the guy. Mad Mark, I'm just to see why. what to Tell me why. Why did I risk everything for this? It is the sheet, boy. It is the foul <laughs> parchment. It is the sheet of the legion. Um, quick aside, do we? Is this open, by the way? Yeah. Is this okay? Yeah, okay. 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 I wasn't sure because I was like, I don't know if I can see in here. Or not. All right. Okay. Make me some make history it. checks. Oh God. I got. I gotta know what this sheet is. <laughs> one definitely. I thought it was a bed sheet. <laughs> no, when he's saying like this is the sheet, you're like, oh yeah, this is the shit. All right. <laughs> Rivetta. <laughs> Upon that man yelling. Uh, that particular term, you and Neve, uh, both either being the training of or being from the area where such people train, know what the Sheet of the Legion is. The Sheet of the Legion is one of the nine great artifacts left behind by the Sage of Nine Paths, the creator of modern-day wizardry. However, it was believed to be destroyed by the heroes of Calcatesh, who faced down Marcellus Kingvel, the Mad Necromancer. Uh, some years ago. It was believed that the sheet was destroyed and that by its destruction, the god of bloodshed, Crowley, was forged. But it would seem that such an artifact is not so easily destroyed. It was recovered in secret, perhaps by unknowing hands. And now, it seems a choice lies before you. I kind of like, all right, so do I have line of sight to Neve? Yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, I'm going to uh, use message on her and say, we need to get him out of here now. Agreed, but I, I, I can't do anything. 
He will have no resistance. We all want him to leave. Forcibly remove him if you have to. Well, come and help then. Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> uh, but I'm why coming. do you need the sheet? Why? He's, he's going to unleash evil into the world. Carter. We will all die. Without it, we cannot undo the darkness that has been wrought within our city. It is the only way to cleanse it. He wants to bring back the mad necromancer. Pick his ass up. Take him out of here. I can do that. Please. Just carry Not him like out if you need to. to carry him out, Arthur. <laughs> the blind one has the yeah. I mean, all things considered, he's pretty fat. We could probably just kill him. Arr, feed him to the spiders. Yeah, there's, there's a freaking lot of those. In the distance, I'm gonna go, let's not do that. Okay. <laughs> you have no opinion, you aren't here. <laughs> Gosh, I guess now it's not okay. I don't even know anymore. Hit him. What do you well, guys if do? I'm standing, if I'm standing behind, uh, Carter, I would like to grab him by the back of his collar and then try to rip the uh, scroll from behind him off his body. Well, he's holding the scroll in his hand now, the scroll case. Oh, even easier. I'm gonna snatch that shit from his hand. <laughs> Alright, make me an athletics check. Oh, you got it. <laughs> shit. Uh, he's a noodle-armed wizard. That's plenty. <laughs> uh, you, you yank the scroll from his hand. He goes, No! No, you cannot steal it from me! No! <laughs> this is bad news. Give it back, please! Take it from my dead cold orc hands. Sarah, I really must protest. We should leave this place immediately. As much as the green skin may be unsavory, he is right. This man cannot be trusted. No, Carter! You must! And he reaches out towards Carter. And with a quick and violent fashion, Sir Dimple will fulfill his duty and impales the noble with his rapier. Oh! oh. oh. Um, uh, uh. Sounds like people are dying. What's going on? You're no, right. We are, I think we need to get out of here. Oh, oh wait, is he going to make that the circle. thing start spinning? Uh -oh. We need to go, we need to go, we need to go. Oh, Lord, run! Lord, run! run! Get out! Lord Foley will fall on the symbol. Blood. I want to see this. Blood will begin to <laughs> pour out. I'm okay with running. Uh, from his wound, but it it starts to get pulled out in an unnatural fashion as, oh, it, begins to, as it begins to seep. Whoa, that's gross. Get out! Uh, get out! I'm gonna run in there and try to like pick him because like <laughs> fat no! like, to, to pull him out You're like, a, get like chopped what, up what in the more, blades. What more good to me? Oh. Turkey, you don't have action yes. surge. Turkey. <laughs> yes. Make me one constitution you, saving throw. Oh right. my fucking right. saving throw. Constitution. Bam. Not Just, bad. Like, Just like you, Dad. As you attempt to rush in to save the nobleman, mere moments before you do, the blood is ripped from his body. The desiccation is completed so quickly that his form turns to dust. The blood rips all around you. You hear his voice call out. It is too late. I think it's too late, guys. <laughs> and that we should go. is all that occurs. Oh. The symbol ceases oh. spinning. The ritual is incomplete. Oh, Something has happened, but you do not know what. You damned fools. Let's go, turkey. Okay, Dad. Hey, uh, by the way, don't don't touch the spider statue. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so uh, that was not uh, that was not ideal. Yeah, Let's I don't think please leave this building right now. Be happy. <laughs> but what if we're safe in here and outside is really bad? Where's Stone? <laughs> there he is. All right. Let's go. Out, out, yes. out. See that one right there? Yeah, don't touch that one, okay? Poof, big splash. 
<laughs> and we step out and the apocalypse has started. Hooray! I'm so stressed. <laughs> we just like looked at Bleak this lies in ruin. Consumed by like this demon circle. We're just like, oh well, okay, bye. <laughs> the uh the party exits. And as you do, Carter will attempt to speak with you. Please, the scroll is my charge. I was tasked with it. Please give it back. I'm, you, you can carry it when we bring it back to Mr. Knuckles. Who? I'm gonna, I want to slap. I want to slap Turkey in the back of the head before he answers again. <laughs> you, just come with us. Thankfully, it seems that the normally very suspicious Sir Dimple Saucy does not notice that exchange. As he is far too worried about what the hell just happened. That's very true. Gross Derek belches as he drinks more from his flask. We don't have to take it from him. Let's just take him back as well. No one has to get hurt. No one has to All get right, scorned. Mark, can find out. grab him. Uh, you don't have to grab I'm him. I'm already holding the scroll. <laughs> just walk with us. Just, just come with us. Very grab well. Grab him. Oh. <laughs> grab him. I'm coming willingly. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. You I just guess, gotta I wear guess. this bag on your head. Don't I worry. Guess, I guess if you want to ruin it. <laughs> <laughs> and so, you return. What does that mean? We get the tavern music back instead of this creepy piano music? Correct. <laughs> <laughs> also, isn't that awesome? I fucking love that music, dude. I yeah, love that I was song. It's creepy, yeah. Slightly scared. Do, do, do. Tavern music. I want to go see my friend. Yay. <laughs> hey. I'm the only one that could save you now. <laughs> yeah. I need my grog. I need my friend. All right. Now, something that you will notice. As you exit the house, the guards will attempt to stop you. But Carter will explain what happened. And as he explains... They seem to buy that, and then they will go inside. In the distance, when you finally make it all the way back to the next district, you can see that the mansion is on fire. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, I probably would have done the same. Yeah, I mean, it's not... It was I mean, did you see the spider statue? Yeah. <laughs> Look like a normal fire? It looks like they're trying to call Rohan. I mean, you know, there's like different color fire, you know, maybe the smoke is weird. The beacons are lit, Rohan. <laughs> Gondor calls for aid. <laughs> Brother! <laughs> we didn't even help him. It is good to see that you have returned. Would Who you are you? Alone? Ah, hello. Uh, whatever. Equisitine, uh... we're looking into your stolen cart. Who? Oh. It, it... Say it. Equisitine, <clears throat> Bublé, Shinslaw, if you <laughs> want your goddamn cart back, don't. Just stop. We're very proud of our name, but yes, thank you. We're looking into it. Exquisitine, Bublé, Shinslaw, select, slash, and forth the fifth. <laughs> Yarr, what about these people out I here? I gently pet his head while I just, like, get up and leave him. I instruct the people that are that have come with yeah, us to like go inside. For them. Yeah. Yarr, gentlemen, come in. Come in. All right. They will enter. It's a crowded room, and we all go to Mr. Knuckles. <laughs> Except me. Yum. <laughs> What's it on the side? On a meta note, I can probably listen. Should have probably like tried to loot some sweet loots from that house if you think about it. I just wanted. To, I, honestly, I, I don't want to do out. with that house anymore. Yeah, right? I want it out. We would have gone to the bathroom, probably get attacked by a shit demon or something. Like, like you know, like in uh, Spirited Away, the gold would turn into spiders in our hands or some shit. Oh, yeah, God. that that entire place was cursed. If we went looting, I'm sure something horrible would have happened. I will tell so. you, I. Uh, 
that that matter was like two additional hours of content but it's not a big oh level. no it's i'm okay. sorry no 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 that's well, the risk. it's on fire now that's we panic. it's okay no it's fine that's the risk that you, you take. made it too scary <laughs> i mean i did we did immediately get the the spider poof so i mean you didn't have to attack the statue <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was threatening me okay <laughs> You even got a like warning when you smashed the bookcase. It's like, well, shit, better keep smashing shit. <laughs> <laughs> better keep smashing. Well, on a meta <laughs> thing, guys, it I. Was evil. But so so, but also on a meta thing, you also didn't think anybody was gonna find the uh, the kind of like relationship bonding stuff. But I did by accident. So there's the. There, you no, can no, only no, that's have fine, one. That's fine. It, it, was either, it was either a best friend Haunted total. Is a double -A or... <laughs> no, I get you. I get you. I get you. I get you. It's fine. It's fine. It's. That's the risk that I always run. Man. That's a risk that I always run. Like yeah, people just ignoring can... NPCs that I thought were interesting. No one will complete the maze. But... <laughs> you don't think Toral is interesting? How fucking dare you? All you have to do Speak is to just my have best absolutely friend. nothing going on, and we're forced to talk to him because there's nothing. Oh <laughs> uh, yes, it seems your quest log is empty. <laughs> I finally have my chance. My <laughs> chance. Please. Maybe help. we can like search through the rubble of the house for something later. To restore my room. honor. Oh, that's true. We could go back to the rubble later after we're done dealing with this. Oh man, it's pretty good. Yeah, stuff, like a though. bunch of scavengers. You could make another quest for it or something. I had a I had a prediction for uh for um like I had a description for the spider statue it was. As you look inside, you see thousands of skittering legs and shining eyes. It is a good thing that this statue is intact, lest the swarm be released. <laughs> Thanks, Cry. Thanks, Cry. I kind of imagine, like, a... like yeah. once it got lit on fire, all the spiders just moved into a different house. <laughs> yeah, you're going right. to have to know for the future, if you ever have any object of any kind, Cry is probably going to try to smash it immediately. Or lick it, yeah. or taste it, or something. Yeah, or smell it, Basically, drink it, Basically, he tries to it. kill himself as soon as possible. Put some yeah. reagents on the ground, he'll roll in it. Cry's like our like our dumb baby that we got to take care of all the time. He's my baby, and I love him. <laughs> Alright, as you approach, he'll be like, oh, that was fast. Wait, I present okay, him the scroll. Right, right. Why did you bring him here? <laughs> it's a complicated seems, story. He's really damaged. <laughs> he's, he's all like, oh, I don't know what to do. That's my only mm, scroll. Ah. I look. I don't. I don't mean to uh, micromanage, but um, <laughs> if you're trying to nick something from somebody, you probably don't want to bring them with you. <laughs> Complicated. See, there was a, a summoning circle and a million spiders, and and we almost died. And the this man didn't even see us, and then he died. And I, I it's complicated. We you tell Mark get it. scroll. Mark get scroll. You know what? That's fair. All right. Uh, do you have it? I present it with both hands. Oh, thank you. Please, yep. sir. That is my charge. To ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Yeah, we stole it from you. Look, I do want to apologize. Normally, we don't have the conversation afterwards. So, I have to be honest with you. I'm not really trained in this. Uh, so, we're sorry that you uh, feel uh -huh. that way. But, um, fuck off. Uh -huh. right, he'll, put the, he'll put the scroll back. Uh, Carter will look dejected. His hands in his head in his hands. Uh, Sir Dimple Saucy will put his hand on his rapier and begin to stand. As and as soon as he does, however, whoa, whoa, with a quick flash, Agent Oliver, uh, oh, excuse me, Olive will appear behind him. Don't. <laughs> Sir Dimple will look up at the assassin and what makes me and what makes you think that I won't cut you in half. Because you would already be dead. Stare down. I mean, he's got a tie. He Sit down. Sit down. That's what I thought. <gasps> hey, it's good to see you again, Olive. Yes, Derek, it is good to see you as well. Are you still gross? Well, let me see. <laughs> he picks his nose and then yep. eats it. Yeah. 
Is that how he yeah. regions mana? It's <laughs> gonna go back over here now. Well, anyway, uh, well, good job. Uh, here you go, and he'll hand out everybody's gold. <laughs> I like how we're just looting this in front of Carter. Carter, Carter is is just. Why am I here? The poor bastard. <laughs> he just, hold up, <laughs> just hold up my bag of gold and nod at Carter. He's gonna, oh. he's gonna Thanks, be a new Carter. NPC in the end. Like, can you help me? I need to get my scroll back. Please right. help me. We need <laughs> to get him and Lefty like I'm, just, I'm sorry. It's like, can you get my scroll back? And he's just like. They will never listen. <laughs> <laughs> Carter just, just joins part. him at that table. <laughs> Put him in the bottom left corner, like right over the here. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> just crying together. We're making a super villain team, guys. This isn't good. This is our headquarters. We get enough NPCs, we'll start a second group to go. Are we, you know? are we, are we oh the God, good guys? Smart. <laughs> Are we the baddies? Is Carter actually sitting down there now? <laughs> no, he. Someone else moved him. <laughs> no, it was, it was me. I, was, he, he's, I, he's mean, up I think it would be funny. He's up here. He's he's. He really wants his scroll back, and Mister Knuckles isn't having it. It's like, look, I mean, I don't mean to be rude, but we stole it from you. Normally, we don't have this conversation. <laughs> But you fair know, is fair. their micro, their management style of their abilities is. Wait, would you just say fair is fair? Finders keepers. Mm -hmm. While they're, we while they're talking, I'm gonna lean into Toral. Hey Toral, do you think you have any scrolls to give that guy? He might be chill out. When I go to Rivita, didn't you say you had a scroll? No. You know. Okay. <laughs> You said you had a scroll, like, in the back. You could give him another scroll, you know, in recompense. Yeah, I was just trying to get away from the smelly guy. I don't have one on me. What? Toro Make will one. stare at Roz. <laughs> Here we go. His eyes will lock with hers. He will try to summon the words. Oh. <laughs> He searches the deep recesses of his mind. He's... He searches. <laughs> he searches. Still searching. Hey, hey, matey. How you doing? As you yet refer to him once again as matey, his eyes glisten. And then... <laughs> he searches deeper into his heart. Yes. Oh God! <laughs> Are you serious with that? that it's wing? serious. Are you serious? Are it's you happening. Hundred percent. This is like they're calling him husband now instead of matey. <laughs> oh. oh God, he's duplicated himself. <laughs> <laughs> He's like Dr. Manhattan. He he's going, he's still at work, though. but he's getting the sugar. I asked what he was doing. You can have like doing. eight twirls at one time. Yeah. Pretty good. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> Parched. Hooray. <laughs> he will begin to uh, pour you a drink with. Uh, sensuality. <laughs> His weird furless knobby arms will reach it out towards you. Do you take it from him? Absolutely. I For a moment, over. your hands touch his. <laughs> and the moment is frozen in his mind. Oh no. And for just a brief moment, the screams of his comrades fade. That can't fight this feeling anymore! <laughs> ah! Okay, that's enough of that. He will then remember that he is a sad, lonely little cat man. You're and even his, more attracted. And then, his, and then his arms will recede into his fur again. I take a large glug that is a tasty frog. He's he happy that you are happy. 
<laughs> and then I reach over and I give him a little a little head pat again. But I'm not scared about it this time. Now I just I just go in for the pet now. <gasps> give him the scritches. <gasps> oh yeah, I give him a little scritch. He wants the yiffin scritch. I give him a little scritch. A little gentle just a gentle scritch. <laughs> As you pet his head. <laughs> I just feel an angle. <laughs> thought you said you were done with this. <laughs> Look, you started petting him, man. Anyway, as you pet him, uh, he will go, I am happy. <gasps> and then the corners of his mouth will begin to. <laughs> Is he chittering, or is that like a ratchet sound? No, that's the... It's the ratchet sound. Have you ever... God, have you ever seen The Corpse Bride where that guy tries to smile? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, that's okay. That's what's happening. That's what that is. That's his cheek going... <laughs> trying to fucking smile. Bending muscles that haven't bend in like a billion years. Yep. And then he will uh, abandon it as his cheeks are tired. <laughs> All right, that's fair enough. But he looks better. Uh, I dropped three gold on the bar counter. <laughs> it only makes him larger. He will absorb the money. And you all are gifted 500 gold pieces for your oh. actions today. Oh, shit! Wow. <laughs> I just want you to know that while that was all going on... Did after you put a <laughs> smile a <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can we get 500 from, from Knuckles and from Toro? No, 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 no. Just, just Knuckles. Yeah, just from Knuckles. Oh, okay. I accidentally, uh, when, I, when I was switching off that song you said we were done with, I forgot I had a Snoop Dogg Gin and Juice open in the tavern. <laughs> I just playing it automatically. <laughs> so that was the song. Well, we are back in the tavern. Yeah, yeah, so it works out. Gin and Juice. <laughs> got my gold on my brain. <laughs> my brain on my gold. <laughs> Anyway, right, I'm just going to sit here and sip my grog. And that will conclude tonight's session. <laughs> <laughs> Mission complete. Da, 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 da. Holy shit. We can't go to sleep and then that's the end like the last time? Oh, I mean, you no, can. Dude. This is like a fade to black one. night. Like, not well, all now it's free role play time. No, we didn't. Uh, no, that's true. Yeah, like not all episodes end the same. That's how shows are, man. <gasps> yeah, you can. You oh, can, you're right. You can do what you like. Okay. I'm, I'm just saying oh. that that's the. Like that. That's what was that, the. That, that was plan. the planned mission yeah. thing. That's. Gotcha. Yeah. Thanks. Small man. Oh hey, what's up? You bothered me, group. Oh sorry, I didn't mean to. How much for the hat? <laughs> uh, five gold. I hand him five gold. He hands you his hat. <laughs> you I put it on. I'm done. All right. You can <laughs> just that. He might not show up next session. I had to make sure. Right, he'll, he'll reach into his bag and he'll pull out another hat and put it on. <laughs> so be <laughs> it. Inspired by my father, I walk up to Mr. Knuckles. Uh, how much for the hat? You don't got the money to pay for my hat. Okay. Oh, wow. Please, sir, I must have the scroll back. <laughs> All right, you know what? I can't take it anymore. Look, you understand that I robbed you, right? Well, not me, but look, it's my scroll. I'm not giving it to you. Please, sir, it's my task to... What are, what? are you brain dead? Can you not? Is that all you can say? <laughs> sir, please, I must have my scroll. Oh, my God. I feel like this is the ep an episode of Roseanne. It's just gonna fade out with the credits rolling while they're arguing and shit. <laughs> but they're scrolled. I'm waiting for Mr. Knuckles to, you know, Directed knuckle him in game. the head. <laughs> sir. <laughs> sir, please. We just didn't want to deal with this. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Give me, give me the <laughs> best reason you can you knuckles? as to why I should give you the scroll back. Because, now they can deal with it, because yeah. Because it is my Not our problem. Delegation. <laughs> <laughs> Takes another large sip watching the argument. Slap. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Sarah, I really must protest. You stand <laughs> up again and I'll have Olive turn you into a quarterling. <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh. That's better. Olive! You know where to put him. Oh, hold on. Oh. 
winky face. Ugh. Oh. I'm right, I'm right there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right there. Hell okay. yeah. I guess. Is, is, is Carter going to be here in the next session at the beginning? Yes. Yes, he will. All right, then I'll, I'll hold it off for then because it's actually story related. <laughs> Oh my god, that's just the shame corner. <laughs> that's the shame corner. I love it. Glug, 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 glug. And then I go cuddle with Dad. <laughs> gonna go cuddle with Dad. Look at my hat. <laughs> oh. Dad, your hat's so eat it. Oh, good hat. Good save today, by the way. Save my life. Mm, anytime. If I can, I guess. Yeah, same here, Dad. Like, respect. You owe me, my boy. Yeah, I do. And then we just fist bump and then go to bed. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, would you three like to do anything? <laughs> I'm just, I'm hanging out. I'm drinking. I'm enjoying hanging with my buddy. All right. Well, Tor will enjoy hanging out with you, although he doesn't know how to do that. Cause he just, he's just staring at me the whole yeah, time. Yeah, he just looks I never at learned you. the hang. He just stares at you. Every once in a while, he'll make a noise like, yeah. Eh. That's his version of purring. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, I see. Yeah. All right. Imagine oh. if he's flirting, he's just like, eh. Because <laughs> 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 he can't roll his R's. <laughs> Are you doing oh, anything, Neve? No. Uh, well, I was going to thank Agent Olive for taking care of Sir Dimple Saucy earlier, but. He, that whole thing went down, and uh, he winked at me before I could do anything, and uh, I, I can feel myself blushing, and I'm overcompensating and making my cheeks turn gray instead of pink, so, and so I just walk away. Ooh. Oh! Someone's got a crush. Omega Lol. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. The usual god. response when anybody has a crush. <laughs> All right, well, in that case, uh, that will conclude <laughs> tonight's <laughs> session. Oh. Thanks, Thanks for DMing. Thanks for DMing. That was great. Sorry about we got the past two hours of content. Oh, don't but... worry about it. You have to understand, I, that happens all the time, so it's not a big deal. Okay. It'll get recycled, I'm sure. Yeah. yeah. It's fine. Totally. It's Shit. I it's mean... Awesome. Don't make it so scary at right, the start, well, then. Was that the first, well, how many times have you done that exact like thing before? What or you have mean? you not done that one? Like, like the, that, that like, mansion all new that new? Left right there? Or like, has anyone ever done that? Uh, has a group done that mansion before? before? Oh, I always custom make everything from the start. I recycle okay. very little. Considering it burned down, it seems like not a reused asset. That's yeah. true. That's it's true. It's burned I was, down for everyone. I was also, uh, it updates to, update to the actual world, so... Yeah, living world. Wait, you didn't have to burn it down. That's what they yeah, would have done. Yeah. yeah. You have, to, you have to understand. Fire, I, you have to understand. I care so much about my world that I will burn it down. If that's what the story Whoa. depicts. Whoa. So. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Respect. Choices have to have consequences, whether they be good or ill. I wonder if I'm like part demon now. Uh, <laughs> no. You are not. <laughs> <laughs> I got bit by a bunch of spiders. Am I Spider-Man now? <laughs> Am I Spider-Man? Uh, uh, no, you are very ill. Go, Web, go! Go, Web, go! Nope, that's just pus. All right. <laughs> oh, 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 fuck. That's fucking vile. Ew. Just pop your blackhead. That's your web. Ew. <laughs> Hyper gross. Cory puke. Anyway, uh, hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Yeah. Yeah. Always a good time, man. That's good. That's good. You're batting a thousand so far. Jeez. It's... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> like, I, I realize a lot of time is spent on, like, gag characters. And I swear, when I made Toral, he was just supposed to be kind of like a, a weird character. But oh no, we're recruiting that motherfucker. No, I know. Chance. He's, but, but he's now... in our party when the final battle, we've done something wrong. <laughs> <He's> <laughs> <not our party. laughs> the bad end, but... 
that he's not at our party at the final battle. <laughs> yeah, he better fucking. We're be. all gonna he be on like be. on our last death roll, and he better show up to be like, no, okay, I got as, you. As someone who's been best friending him the past two campaigns, if he doesn't do something for us or like becomes my new like pet cat or something, I'm gonna be real. I'm still waiting to learn that he's real like, mad. Some eldritch abomination or something. <laughs> <laughs> He's got to be. He's got to be Cthulhu. It's, he's got own, fucking it's the only shit, way man. that this makes sense, dude. I'm, I'm also, out of fear and hunger. You, you've, uh, you've romanced Cthulhu. Well done. Cthulhu, got him. There you I, go. I, uh, I really like. Um, you guys have a lot of good inter-party reactions too. So I, I've oh. really been enjoying that myself. Good shit. <sighs> I mean, and also, uh, most of my NPCs uh, haven't really seemed disinteresting to you guys, except one, of course. But <laughs> what's that guy's name again? I really like oh, that no. sewer druid. I, I love how you, you call like... him Hollow. You didn't even know. You didn't even <laughs> acknowledge his name, even though it's on the screen. You still said it wrong, just to insult him. <laughs> you, you guys like Gross Derek? I love Gross Derek. Love Gross, Gross Derek was the best. That's my new character inspiration right there. <laughs> you Gross. Gross motherfucker. <laughs> Gross Derek. What are you? I'm a sewer druid. Ooh. What? Ooh. Oh, sewer God. Druid. Did All I right. stutter? All right. People, uh, pe people want the furry story. Oh, yeah. yeah. You're going to have yeah. to let them know. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Now um, I will tell you what I meant by I don't want to do that again when he asked me to <laughs> roll for girth. <laughs> okay. Okay. No, so it was length, not girth, but I uh, understand. Okay. Let me completely different. Let me explain what horrible things I had to go through in the past. Uh, oh, long, no. long ago, before I had any real reputation and before Twitch and all of that, and people only knew about me in word of mouth, I had to get D and D games. You know, I had to get you know commissions and business as I could. Well, I'm a I'm a big believer that anybody should be able to play D&D. I don't care who they are. I, I run for anybody that believes in anything as long as they respect the game. So, <laughs> Jesus. Uh, <laughs> sorry. You have to understand something else, though. There is a uh, D&D tabletop, oh, not D&D, but a tabletop system called Fatal. Now, Fatal is one of the worst things ever created. It, it is awful. <laughs> That's the first that's the first thing you need to know. And I won't go into too much detail, but I will give you this one detail so that you kind of understand how awful this system is. Uh in Fatal, you actually roll for anal circumference. Mm. So that gives you an idea of how ridiculous that entire thing is. Now, as it just so happens, there is a group of people that self-proclaimed them as furries that was looking for somebody to run a game for them. And uh, nobody would run from them. And they were, they were like, black sheeped, ostracized, like, made fun of. People would flame their forums every time one of them tried to ask for a game. People hated them. Purely on the fact that they were, like, weird to them. So I took it upon myself to run a game for them. Because everybody should get to play D&D. So, <laughs> what happened was we all sat down and they started asking me questions like, so we want to play like these anthropomorphic animals. And then I was just like, you got it, champ. Boom, here are some rules. Let me make some mechanics for you guys. Bam, 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 bam. I basically spent like an extra 12 hours rewriting a bunch of rules for them uh, so that they could play it in Pathfinder. And we did. We sat down and we played. Everything was going great. Their characters were introduced. Everybody was kind of feeling it. Some people used voices. Everybody was kind of into it. And it's like a basic D&D party, except the only difference is that one of them was a shark man, there was a jackal guy, and there was a giraffe man. You know, that's it. That's really the only differences. I love the giraffe man. You're gonna However, <laughs> that did not last long. <laughs> because then they walked down the road. And as they began to walk down the road, things took a turn. They began to interact with each other. And, <sighs> and then it went wrong. And then, That's how it all went wrong. Yeah. And then the Fire Nation attack. And then they found a meadow. And with enough space, they began to uh, vigorously 
uh, make love to each other. <laughs> <laughs> and the shit I had to answer in that first session haunts me to this day. <laughs> and I'll give you, I won't go into too much detail or give too many examples because we'll be here forever, but I will give you a few so you can understand the chaos of this. These are the things I had to determine that session. The viscosity of various types of semen. I had to determine um, how long one could maintain an erection with three penises. Oh. I had to determine... Uh, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying don't that. Don't say that. Not, oh. that one. not that one. But it's don't like forget. that. It's like that. Uh, don't, don't forget the giraffe over the fence. Oh, I'll get to that. I'll get to that. That's second session. Okay. See, oh, that oh, was, right, right, of course. Yeah, that was first session, right? <laughs> My bad. My I, bad. I also had to answer a bunch of questions about necrophilia that I had to look up in order to answer, and I regret <laughs> that. I regret that so much. So that was the first session. They all thanked me for my time, and even though I made $50 that day, I felt like it wasn't worth it. But <laughs> I am a man of my word, and I told them I'd run a game for them. A DM institute, if you will. And then uh, the second session rolled around, and that was when they got to interact with other NPCs. And by interact, I mean, well, there's no <laughs> other way to really put it. They just, the two guards up front were like, Hail, adventurer, what's your business? And they're going at him. They're My just, name is mm. Buck, and I'm here to fuck. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> but the, the strangest thing about the second session, without a doubt, because all the rest of them were just, like, normal degeneracy that I could, like, understand. There's one guy who stood out, and that was the giraffe man, and I'll tell you why. <laughs> because fuck yeah. everybody else is, like, tugging it and all that shit. This guy is just like, so, Arcadum, can you tell me what the townspeople are doing? Can I see over the wall because of my neck? And I'm like, yeah, you can. <laughs> and I was so thankful that I started describing the, everything he wanted. And then I noticed that he was getting kind of weird about it. And he's like, can you say that slowly? Let me ex describe. Like, he asked me to describe, like, what the blacksmith was doing and what, like, the baker was doing and stuff like that. Right? And I didn't realize that it was weird until after he started asking, yeah, and how hard is he hitting the anvil? And I'm like, <laughs> the normal the hardness <laughs> and then and then he's like, okay, so this is what my character's doing. And he just literally described that his giraffe is just wanking it while watching the townsfolk. Epic gamer move. Like, I'm just... <laughs> like you have to understand, it was so bad. I told so... this story before, and I had an artist actually draw that giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> and I used Do you it, have the picture? I used it as my uh, Skype picture oh, <laughs> oh my god hold on let me Please see please tell let me, me you have it let me see if i actually have it hold on i'll uh let me I put the this. let me let me let me see if is, I, it, is it him in the act or just as a just like a head over a wall watching yeah it's a, it's a it's a head over the wall watching if i recall oh, oh like a god. doctor disrespect in the bathroom <laughs> thing. okay you can't stop me <laughs> you can't stop me i'm a giraffe <laughs> I Let talk. me see if I have it. I don't know. It's been a long time since she, she drew it. I don't even remember which like thing it was. It, I, I don't think I have it anymore. No, it's not not easily available. Oh, but we understand. Oh, actually, it might be in my Skype pictures. Hold on. Oh, oh no. Let's see. Uh. I'll never think of Toys R Us the same ever. <laughs> I know, that's immediately where I'm thinking of. Too. Jeffrey is oh, ruined. <laughs> dude, uh. dude, it was... I, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's I, fine. I, it's, it's so... It's so... 50 bucks is 50 bucks. It was... It was... God, it was awful. Because, <laughs> like, like I, I really wanted to support these people. But... but You're a fucking I, saint. I, you are like, and then we we didn't we didn't make it to the third session because of scheduling issues and i'm like oh no that's so oh oh jeez oh, 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 oh man oh well you know uh, you know it happens guys it's okay yeah. scheduling is the uh hardest we're like you know you maybe think... we maybe we could do it later i can't go any later do you think at any one point they're all like man i'm glad arcadum is dming for us and making all these erotic stories for us it's so great just, I can't find it in Skype either. <laughs> uh, I've, actually, I could load up my Skype, and then I could, like, bring the profile picture. Then you picture. get a virus. Oh, okay. 
Actually, no, I can do that. Hold on. No, I'm going to show you at least a little oh. bit of it. Okay. Just, just the okay. face. The face is hilarious. It did it, it did, she did a great job on it. This is more like I want to promote her good work. <laughs> okay, hang on. I got to pull up the Twitch. Oh, shit. Hang on. Holy shit. I forgot no. it looks so good, dude. Hang on, hang on. You see, Ugh. without you going through that strife, we wouldn't have these amazing stories, so I appreciate what you did. All right, I'm going to snip it. I'm going to use the snipping tool. How long ago was this again, by the way? What, the furry group? Yeah, like, when was this? And was oh, it in person or over the internet? Oh, God, it was not in person. Okay. Sweet Jesus. Just be hot miking. $50 session. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's uh, that's oh, the hell yeah, Arcadum's online. There he is. I love that angle. Yeah, the angle is great. Oh, I'm upset. That's such, like an imposing, intimidating angle for what he's doing. Yeah. <laughs> Here, I'm showing. I'm, I'm, I'm showing. I'm showing chat. Oh my. Here God. you go. There you go, chat. This is what you wanted. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. I hate it. Oh, giraffe action. <laughs> I love the face. Dude. Thank you for sharing. <laughs> you're, you. you're welcome. Oh, I'm gonna go uh, now. Uh, I'm okay. gonna yeah. see you. My... <laughs> thanks for thanks for playing, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely, yeah. man. Thanks for next, sharing. See you next week. Man, see you next week. And yeah. see, I was gonna tell you like a really nice story, but now I just feel like you can't that like. I it. it was only somewhat nice. No, okay. Well, it was kind of, sort of nice. More nice than. What Arcadum just said. I'm sorry. Are you what? saying his story's not nice? Yeah, well, well, but it's I was nice in just a different kind of way. See, we had a we had a twirl thing that we did for a couple of minutes. <laughs> where, where... <laughs> you would like to hear it? Oh sure. What's up? What you got? Read for? it. All Read right, it. All right. Sheena, you you start with the petting. Oh, okay. Hang on. Let Wait, me is this a fanfic? Ahead. Yes. No. You, you guys yeah, made a yeah. fanfic. Yes, that's I'm so flattered. To, oh, I can't wait. Zoom in on a picture yeah. of Coral and then you right hear now. it. And you're yeah, like, hang I'm on. You gotta yeah, hold, on. hold on. I'm zooming in on him. All right, go ahead. Toral read. and Arxoraz. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Right. I, I searched Toral in our uh, yeah we'll, in our we'll chat. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so you started on, with that. Okay, okay, so... Looking at me. Okay, okay, okay. So I started off because last Saturday, I sent Naomi the cry petting emote. Yeah, and said, morning pets. And I responded, Toral begins to vibrate frantically, unblinking. Oh my god. And then I do the pet emoji again. Too many gnarled hands extend outward from Toral's body. You have I gotta no go. idea why Toral has so many hands. <laughs> out. Petting or stop. <laughs> no! Continue. They didn't like it. Wait. Yeah, we'll clip it and send it to them later. Continue. It wasn't gross or creepy. It wasn't it gross was... and creepy. No, it, it wasn't. It wasn't that kind of fan Man. fiction. Well, I really don't want to hear it now. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck them. I'm, I'm going to continue All anyway. Right. So then I say, I say, keep betting. Toral lifts off of the ground ever so slightly and a haze begins to envelop him as he continues buzzing. Countless arms now extending from his body making strange gestures. Do you dare keep <laughs> petting or stop? And you I can't said, escape, John. <laughs> I said, I said, keep petting. <laughs> Suddenly of course. the world around you disappears. There is only you and Toral. His pupils dilate until his eyes are a deep obsidian. You find yourself drawn into his gaze. Quite literally, actually. Your entire body is compressing, pulled forth towards that eternal abyss. It doesn't cease. It doesn't hurt. A flash, and you no longer see Toral. You only see darkness. Quiet. Warm. You try to blink, but you feel as though you've been dipped in molasses. Then, at the edges of your vision, light. And then I send an exclamation, because I'm like, <gasps> You try to look, but you can't move. You don't feel trapped. You don't feel you. The light widens. You begin to see shapes, tables, bottles, figures. There's someone in front of you, reaching out with a single gold piece in hand. Suddenly you realize you and Toral have become one. 
As this realization washes over you, you become aware of other vague consciousnesses around you, others drawn in by those large, unblinking eyes. You are all Torals now, his collection of souls, stolen in an ever-desperate attempt to fill that void inside his own heart and mind. Ever failing, you have no more options. Succumb to Toral. I said succumbs. Oh my god. <laughs> all right, uh, would you guys like to see the Twitch chat Why would you D&D give into that? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> All right. So uh, the first first iteration of Twitch chat plays D and D. Um, I made the character, and then chat just played as them. Okay. And the second iteration, they made the character themselves. This is what the character is that they made. What the fuck is that? Uh, what is that? Oh, that is Ratasha Mouse. Rat Tasha. <laughs> rat Tasha Mouse. Yes. Uh, rat Tasha Mouse. She is a rat folk uh, gender of yes. Uh huh. Um, with a technical ab- aberration uh, and and an, and an inquisitor of Vitoric, the, the, so the, the deity of love. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, God. Well done, chat. Well yes, done. good job. Does she use chat. a parasol for like a yes, weapon? Yes, she does. Nice. Or, yes, it does. <laughs> Answer, yes. Yes, 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 does. There you go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What have I done with my life? You know, I also do believe Toro is a uh, vessel of many souls. Like the screen fiction. Here, sure, some of it is from the war, but also some of it is the souls that he has stolen. <laughs> I'm you know, glad you guys like Toril so much. He's probably like a seven-year-old, like a seven hundred-year-old demon or something. I'm sure. Whatever, I love him. He's my best friend. <laughs> what, Making what deals part? with the See devil. Him now one. The best part would honestly be if he was just like a fucking normie. If you really think about it. like his his real life, he's just like you know a little little kid in his his like species or something who doesn't do anything special. But to us, he's just so weird it's like, like <laughs> when he actually goes home he's like hello everybody <laughs> i think you are cool yes <laughs> i like your hair ross it is very yes <laughs> i hope one day you will look at all and go yes <laughs> oh, no. do, you, do you like Toro's new accent voice i hope he knows that i'm human and maybe, maybe I become less appealing that way. You are more appealing because you are so kind to Toro. Oh, <laughs> you're in too deep. There's there, no getting out. There now. is, yeah. there is no difference. Toro learned long ago not to see race. Oh, for his, I should, I should. Oh. For his comrades were of different races. Oh no! I should give him a head smooch. Yet next they episode. all die the same. Oh. And every Their time blood yet runs, still runs red. His heart races anyway. Like it did all those years ago with every life taken. <laughs> I feel like as soon as Toro gets attached to somebody, he accidentally kills them or something. Now I'm concerned for my I'm life. Sorry, they are taken. I... <laughs> it's once they hug him and he starts vibrating and all that's the what I mean. From like... your bones. Yeah. All right. You know what? Maybe I should make a Toro emote. I don't know. Dude. You should. <laughs> you should. He's my favorite. <laughs> oh, God. Gotta make one. Oh God! Gotta unlock a new slot, and I'm gonna use Toral on it. That's what I'll use. Yeah, that'll be good. <laughs> or replace one of these other crappy emotes. Go out with it. Or make it a BTT emote. Oh yeah, I could do that. Yeah. Oh yeah. Or like make the other emote a BTT emote and Toral one of yours because that's it's... true too. Because then it'd be global. Oh dude, I could make the vibrating one. The. uh... <laughs> TV one, yeah, that's of animated just, of him just, just him just vibrating, dude. That'd be sick. See, I want uh, I want Toral emotes so that people can go in your guys' chats when you're streaming and just look at you, stare at you, just stare <laughs> at you, dude. Just, I hope so. Just fucking stare at you, man. No, I want that. <laughs> I mean, that's honestly a lot of people probably pull a tour and they don't realize it. Like right now during the stream. They're what just watching while they're watching the stream. Guys, don't forget yeah. to blink, please. You'll become Toral. Toral chat. A day. How many Torals in chat? Any Torals in chat? Any blinks? Lurkers. Any blinks? <laughs> <laughs> That's 
good stuff, dude. Alrighty. Family festivities are starting because I'm hearing a lot of loud Spanish music, so I should probably actually get Lay. out here. And, uh, yeah, no, it's... I gotta get I ready hear... for Calus Row anyway. Go, go, go! I hear, go. I hear really... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a good session. Good times. Uh, yeah. Are we yeah. good for next week? Next week mm -hmm. is the uh, 1st of November. Yeah. Uh, yes. Alrighty, well, I'll see you guys then. Have a fantastic uh, yeah. evening. Okay. Oh, Bye. Till next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.